Tea Talks is good today. I'm proper hungry. I actually enjoyed that. That was funny. You get it. No, you're going to lose. I'm sorry. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Best race win, man. <laughs> best <Yeah>. race win. <laughs> Welcome to Kicked in College Podcast. We got Michael, Jordan, Quabs, Tasha. And today we're going to be doing the Nigerian versus Ghanaian Jollof. So, so Ghana. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Jollof is better than Rice and Peas, by the way. Well, stop uh, this. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I don't want to go that far. I don't right. even like rice and peas, but stop this. Really? What? I know, I know, I know. Hold on a second. I know, I know, I know. Wow. It's gonna get ugly in here. I feel yeah. like <laughs> it's always ugly when Gany and Jalof is involved. Uh, it's just yeah. trash, bro. <laughs> 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 all right, so we're gonna start off today's episode um, by talking to one of our special guests, Tasha. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! hey. <laughs> Who is doing some super inspiring work on Instagram and within the community? So she is the founder and creator of um, this amazing page on Instagram called Black Execs. And it's essentially what it is, is a platform for people to access a network of local black businesses in the GTA. Right? Did I get that right? Okay, awesome. Um, So Tasha, can you start by telling us a little bit about your platform, about the page, what kind of inspired you to create it? And what is the goal of your project? Huh, okay. Loaded. <laughs> I know. No pressure. Just okay. Tell us everything. Okay. Okay. Um, so uh, I was working on it for a few years, mm. and we're really inspired. It. Well, okay. I have a background in social work, mm. so um, through social work, I just found that I love working with Black communities, as I'm part of the Black community. So. Um, a lot of times I just found some of the jobs maybe that I was snagging weren't really in tune with my passion. And mm-hmm. so I really started to look into like, okay, what can I do through my work um, and still in like influence the black community? I love so that. I decided, okay, I'm going to go with somehow supporting black businesses because that was kind of my way of supporting the black community. Mm-hmm. Um, and I found that it was very hard sometimes to find black owned businesses. And as I was trying to support more black owned businesses, um, it was harder for me to locate. Now there were directories out there, but I kind of wanted to see what else I could do. So I decided to put together a directory. And then on top of that, go to like black business owners and ask them like, what do you want or what would like benefit your business? Mm. Um, and a lot of them were saying like marketing. So I said, okay, let me figure out how I'm going to do this. Um, I ended up um, studying my master's in social work. Yes, sir. And that's when I said, okay, like I'm going to go full, full, like steam ahead with yeah. this, you know, black business platform thing. And I was going to like business classes. Uh, I was seeking out mentors. I was talking to business owners. I was talking mm. to the community. I was seeing kind of what people wanted, what people would be interested in, and I put it together. Like, the directory, like, right now it's static. Um, I'm hoping by the time that this gets released, it's a little bit more. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> but um, what we do is we pre-upload Black-owned businesses, um, and then we also create marketing content so that they can market their product or service nice. to yeah. the general community. And we, yeah, we just, we're trying to create a space to centralize black businesses. So if you're ever looking for one, mm. this is where you, you know can where go. to go. Mm-hmm. Exactly. I love that. <laughs> love it. Love that. Exactly. And that's yeah. a, that's actually what I was going to talk to you about next mm-hmm. was the marketing. So just yeah. like the campaign that she's developed, check it out, Black is X on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> it's so amazing. So obviously all the resources that you're offering, the list of black businesses that you're compiling, it's so mm-hmm. extensive. But beyond that, you're really like creating a brand for yourself. Mm-hmm. And like, just like the <laughs> graphics and everything, like so polished, you know, Thank so you. like the look and feel so professional. And like i'm sure that can't be easy so like can you speak a little bit about how long you've been working on this and um what does it take to get an initiative of this scale like actually live and like up and running yeah (laughs) oh my 
gosh. Okay, it must so be a lot. Like, yeah. I feel like there's a lot of, I feel like yeah. just a lot of pieces. And it seems like you just I mean, haven't forgotten about anything. You know what I mean? Hey, like, everything's geez, just so, you. like, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> because behind the scenes, it's crazy. Um, so when people, like, tell me, oh, like, from, from, what, from what they're seeing, it's just very clean and cut. Like, oh, my God, thank you. Um, but... So when I first started, I was, I don't know, I was delusional. I wanted to get it up within the month. I was like, let's do this. I want to do this. Like, mm-hmm. I let, let's go as fast as we can. And it took me two years before we were actually ready. So, yeah, not at all what I had in mind. I even, I remember we built all the platform, mm-hmm. like literally 90% done. All we had to do was the web design. And the whole thing crashes. Like, oh, my gosh. <laughs> all, like, we had a whole bunch of features in it. We had a whole bunch of stuff in it. And you know what? I was advised by like tech experts and stuff. Mm. Don't do that. Like you have to put out the MVP, which is the most viable product, mm. and then slowly start to build things. And like that's how most apps start, right? But you know, I had my my chest was high. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, nah, I want to have everything. Big plans, yeah. <laughs> and so we built it out. It crashes. It took us six months to rebuild. Oh, wow. And then finally, when we were Whoa. ready, the pandemic hits. And I'm like. God, yeah. I was like, what am I going to do? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, am I going to still launch this thing? Yeah. yeah. And um, I actually consulted with one of my good friends, and he was like, bro, like, you have to launch this. Like, yeah. it's just been way too long. So I said, okay, I'm going to launch it. And then, yeah, I ended up being, like, kind of, like, perfect It's timing. a good time. Really yeah. Good time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a great time. It yeah. was right before everyone was like, okay, how do we buy black, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so, yeah. I'm mm-hmm. happy I wasn't caught up in the hype necessarily, mm-hmm. but, like, we started a little bit before that, and then kind of just rode the wave, and things have been going really good. Yeah. Um, I hope I answered all your questions. Oh, my gosh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, no, for sure. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for sharing, because, like, we obviously only see the finished product that you've put yeah. out there, and we're like, damn, this looks fucking good. Thank and you. we don't know, like, yeah. the level of yeah. work and detail that's gone in behind the scenes, yeah. right? Yeah. So, um, Definitely a team effort, I would say. Yeah. I mean, it's not me on my own. Like, yeah, Can I you talk a little bit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, I could never. You, you <laughs> <laughs> you did social work, but you did that. Can like, you talk? Oh. Yeah, no, I got Let's my go. social media girl, um, Chanel. Yeah. I got um, my team who does who handles the videography, so that's the marketing of the businesses. Um, yeah. And that's well, right now it's Wee Media. Before we were working with Dawn Productions, both amazing. Um, and also shot by Selena. She does so, some of my video work. Um, the owner of Comatic, Calvin, he does my editing. So, like, yeah, it's a lot of movies. Wow, and music. takes a it village. Must be, it must be. <laughs> <laughs> a lot is a lot. <laughs> no, that's amazing. Um, okay, so mm-hmm. it's been super successful. I'm sure you're getting like great levels of engagement, especially mm-hmm. now that since people are like home and like mm-hmm. more drawn to social media, just like organically. Mm-hmm. Um, what advice would you have for people our age that? want to do what you do so like they want to start a business or start an initiative they want to be an entrepreneur right what would you what advice would you give them like something that you've learned from your journey because honestly like sometimes it's a really tough sometimes it's a really tough decision to like start something like that and people are very hesitant because it's a lot of time money a lot of hard work that you're investing and you're kind of all like putting it all into this idea that you don't really know, know what to you're going to, yeah, you don't know where to start. You don't know what you're, what you're going to get from it. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> so yeah. How do you, how do you, did you, were you ever uncertain and like, 100%. what advice do you have? A hundred percent. Like, especially when my platform crashed and we were just about to launch. Oh my gosh. Like, yeah. I was like, bro, why am I doing this? <laughs> 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 why am I putting all this money, all this time? Like, yeah. and that was around when I was, so when you do your master, you have to do an MRP, which is like a mini thesis. So it crashed right in the heat of me doing this like massive paper Yeet. to graduate. And like <laughs> I was just so stressed out. Um, I would say like, because most most people who started initiative, you have a nine to five, right? So if you do decide to like take up something, um, I feel like your heart has to be in it. Uh-huh. Like cause if it's not, it's so easy to be like, oh, I'm, I'm not doing this no more. I'm not into yeah. it. Yeah. Um, That's facts. And honestly, like now I look back and I'm like, thank God it crashed when it did, <laughs> because then it wouldn't have allowed us to launch when we did, which was like perfect timing. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. And that's one thing that I've learned. Like 
I've learned to love the obstacles because I know. Okay, I love like, that. <laughs> yeah, because no, literally, like, Trust okay, the process, like recently yeah. <laughs> we had a giveaway, right? And it was a staying connected series. So like an interview we were giving away. And for whatever reason, Instagram wasn't wasn't letting us promote it. Mm. And we were trying to get it like out there, like blast it. And Instagram just wasn't having it. It was glitching. It wasn't even declining a request. But that was what we were going to use to really make this giveaway big. And now, like, it just flopped on us. So I was literally like, yo, let's just shut it shut it down. I'll take the people that entered. I'm not going to promote it anymore. And my social media girl was like, no, no, no. Let's play with it. Let's see what we can get out of it. Mm. And we ended up connecting with, like, one of the biggest names in the city because we reached out to him to promote it for us. That's amazing. So, like, wow. You know, like, you can't buy certain things like that. And it's like, that was, that was a massive obstacle. I was feeling so down. Mm. And because we continue to work within it, you just like get these opportunities that land on your doorstep. So yeah. Wow. That's dope. That's dope. That's yeah. amazing. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. And Thank it's you. super yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Uh-huh. Trying. Yeah, trying. Yeah, yeah. Keep <laughs> trying. Keep yeah. Going. I would definitely say like it's for needed. me, why why I decided to do it was like I well, uh, this is a personal thing, but um there's certain things I don't want to go to my deathbed regretting. Mm. So I was like, if I don't do this, like I'm gonna regret it. And mm. yeah. So I guess like any advice like think about that yeah yeah <laughs> decide, big like, question it's not something like if yeah, you don't do it that. you're gonna be okay not doing that for the yeah. rest of your life yeah oh i love that that's dope thanks man <laughs> um okay but tell us a little bit about tasha mm. Outside of black execs, like, mm, mm. how do you manage your day to day? I'm sure you're super busy uh, running the super successful platform. <laughs> but like, what do you do outside of this project? Um, I work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you I sound work. like fun. Um, there you go, there you go. Um, I love my job. Um, yeah, luckily, I'm doing two things I love at once. Um, but yeah, I work in the field of social work. And mm. I don't know. Like, I'm not really trying to touch on that too much. <laughs> <laughs> I, I get it. You, yeah, you can leave it there. You can leave it there. <laughs> my mom also does, um, works social work, and she, that's all she talks about with my grandma every day. Yeah. I just hear them talking about it every yeah. day. Yeah, I love it. She works for CAS, I think. Oh, CAS? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah I work closely alongside CAS, but yeah. Cool. Yeah. Well, yeah. happy to hear you're still enjoying it. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's good. It's good. It's good. But other than that, I hang out with friends, you know, regular girl stuff. Yeah. <laughs> She's just a regular person. Regular, regular. Just like everyone else. <laughs> just bossed up. So, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Cool. And for other guests, Cabana. Thank you for being here. Oh, Thank you. Thank you for having me. What are you? <laughs> I, know, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know you're not going to compare to what... Um, Oh my gosh, no. don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that. No, it's true, though. That's a hard stage to walk on. 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 I'm here for the bench. I'm here for the bench. I'm just here to... I'm expect a large segment for I'm just here to defend my country, you know? <laughs> that's what you're saying. Defend my pride. That's about it. <laughs> <laughs> no, but Kavana, what do you do outside of this podcast um, uh, today? I cook for a living. Um, really? Yeah, You're yeah. a chef? Not Why? a chef, chef, but yeah. <laughs> Why? That Maybe sounds like a chef. Like, <laughs> uh-huh. we, you could become a chef, no? I could become a chef, yeah, mm-hmm. but I don't know. So you did culinary? Uh, no. No? It was just a like a passion, and then oh slowly and slowly, I just like worked my way up into like really good restaurants. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. What was your first cooking job? First one was at Wonderland. Wonderland? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> wow. Pizza? Was it pizza? Day. No, what's that place called? Coasters. Oh, is it the retro looking The retro place? Like, looking Oh my place? gosh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I always wanted to eat there. Mm-hmm. And then... I went at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> Did you really? I was a rides He was rides, yeah. yeah. And I worked with Mike at, at St. Louis. Oh, yeah. Cool. Uh, that was a... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you guys were in the kitchen today? Yeah, yeah. 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 Like you were cooking... It was, a very, <laughs> it was a very interesting time. Nah, man. Mike, Mike was there for bad, so it was yeah. funny. <laughs> <laughs> I was just there to get everyone laughed, so. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, can I ask you something then? Yeah, Since sure. you're in the business of following your passion, yeah, yeah. when did it become like a hobby versus a career for you? 
don't know. It's always like been a hobby for me. My mom's a, like a, a chef, so. Mm. Oh, that's amazing. Like I've been cooking like at home since I was like young. Yeah. And then I just started like working in like restaurants and then kind of just like. Yeah. I don't know. It comes like a, a passion. You just want to see how far you could get in it. That's amazing. And then, yeah. You worked at a pretty big one downtown, right? Yeah, Jacobs & Co. Oh, it's oh, pretty wow. lit there, yeah. We got a lot of like That's sports bougie. teams. Really bougie. Oh, nice, so, yeah. nice. I just it's fun. my birthday, so so I can dress up. <laughs> <laughs> We're not, we only do takeout right now because of the, the oh. pandemic. But oh, for real? Really? Yeah. So you guys haven't transitioned back like the rest of the restaurant? Nah, it's weird. It's I don't even know, like understand maybe the full logistics of it. Maybe they know our second wave is about to come. So yeah. They're, 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 yeah, they're being responsible. <laughs> <laughs> like, there's no point. Yeah. <laughs> what is like, have you met famous people at yeah, work? The most famous was Drake. What? That was the, you <laughs> met <laughs> Drake. That was, a, that was a very interesting night. Yeah, oh my God. met Drake. What happened that night? So uh, <laughs> we close at 11. This is like 1030. Like the manager comes in like, oh, we have a Drake wants to come in. But we were like he all like Drake? gun. Did he say Drake? He said Drake. Yeah. Oh, okay. And like, we're like, fuck, we, we don't want this. Like, whatever. When you said Drake, you sort of like, fuck. To be honest, I was excited, but like the guys, like the guys, are, like that was my first time seeing. He's been there before, but like everyone else there has like seen him, and then oh, okay. I, like, I want to expose him. But <laughs> he's a, a interesting character, so like comes in super late, takes his takes a shit ton like ton of time to like order and stuff. So you're just like waiting there, waiting for him to order. <laughs> But what was really cool, like after he ate, he came by and like thanked everyone. Oh, that's but, lovely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what no, he do. should though, because like you know he knows his past your shift. I would say hopefully I don't get in trouble for saying this, but he's kind of like a cheap guy. No way. <laughs> <laughs> not no, but like not in like tipping and stuff, but like what he ordered, it was so weird. Like he came, so like before he came, like his security guards came in, mm-hmm. like scoured the whole restaurant, <laughs> would would not, and then. Um, they're like they all sat in like four corners of the restaurant that he sat hilarious. there with like that one, girl. Crazy. <laughs> one girl yeah, he idea. came with like a guest like but a she date? didn't eat one person, one person. Oh, she okay. didn't eat only he ate he ordered like a <laughs> a four ounce steak with like some side <laughs> 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 and she just like watched him eat oh my god ate his thing came it's like, like you're buying your own yeah <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Like, yeah. Out. like you just try to yeah. like, he was like, yo, you want to eat? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you know, on a dinner with date, I would have been like one of everything. Yeah. Yeah. He was like, what? Yeah, give me the but, whole uh, platter. <laughs> just cause it just take one. Yeah. The second time he came, yeah. it was kind of funny because like he came like during service. Cause like he wanted to come later, but like, oh, we can't do it. You have to come like now. And like it was like while we were closing. Mm-hmm. So like people like they're just sitting there they like look up like what the fuck just like fucking drink here <laughs> so everyone's like done their food but they're just like ordering drinks and like drinking just like staring at him <laughs> it was a good time yeah wow that's so cool mm-hmm. that's pretty sick wow yeah, yeah. <laughs> I would have just poked my head out every time what's it called <laughs> what's it called Jacobs and Co Jacobs and Co yeah I heard like basketball players go there too like, yeah we got the after we got the the Nets they were pretty cool they gave us like they came in. And then after they like mailed us like a bunch of like jerseys and like shirts oh and like hats God. and stuff. Yeah. That's amazing. Oh, wow. Yeah. Everyone in Homage I only got one like warm up shirt, but oh, wow. <laughs> it's yeah, comfy still. It? It's comfy. <laughs> Did they actually give jerseys? Jerseys, jerseys, like sweaters, oh, hats. Shit. Oh, yeah. Wow. They're like really nice. Yeah. Mm. And then we got like the Leafs, the Raptors, TFC, like all those sports teams come in. That's crazy. Mm. That's really cool. So we're going to introduce the word of the day now. And then, what happens when you say, say the word of the day, Pearl? You take a shot. <laughs> mm-hmm. Throw it back. <laughs> mm-hmm. What are we? What are we drinking today, Mike? Uh, Virginia Black by oh, Drake. Yes, by Drake. <laughs> by Drake. <Shots> Drake. <laughs> <laughs> did he mail you? Did, did he mail you guys bottles? <laughs> <laughs> no bottles, bro. Yeah. Yeah. So today's word is why. You can't say why, or you take a shot. Come on, bro. <laughs> it's a hard one. It's a hard one. And we're actually going to be vigilant this time because we've been like kind of lacking in the past mm. couple of episodes. Yeah. We're letting our guests oh, get super, away with yeah. it. Yeah. Really? <laughs> yeah. Super, super, no super. one's going home drunk, which is not what we want. So, <laughs> <laughs> so uh, starting now? Starting now? Starting now? Starting now? All right. Okay. 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 Pork walk. Okay. Oh, <laughs> 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 oh, my God. All right. Okay, okay. Okay, so... 
our guests um, on our on our show. Mm-hmm. We usually ask our guests like questions, the same five questions, and they have to relate with like food okay. for the most part. Okay. Um, and you'll be joining like a team based off like. <laughs> Based off your answer, you're basically yeah, doing a team. Yeah. All our guests are going to be on either this team or this team by yeah. the end. Okay. Yeah, season, big, the yeah. first season. Okay. It creates yeah. a big divide. <laughs> exactly. Okay. Huge. Okay. And I'm ready. I'm, I'm going to follow you. Um, <laughs> but first question. Okay. First question. What do you guys think about pizza pizza? It's horrible. Okay. Thank you, Tasha. <laughs> Thank you. Cabana. Depends. What do you like? Their, their no, actual pizza? Or yes, like, their pizza. Their actual pizza. It used to be really good. I don't know what they did. You know oh what? It God. used to. Yeah, it did. When we were <laughs> children. When we were kids, yeah. As soon as they rolled out that, like, 9, 6, 7, 11, and they got, like, super big. <laughs> It was done. Yeah. Like, it was yeah. done. I remember I used to order like pizza pizza every day, like after yeah, like, in like yeah, in high okay. school though. Mm-hmm. And then like all of a sudden it just got super trash. Mm-hmm. But their wings are popping though. Mm-hmm. They're you breaded wings? wings? No, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I used to think that up until like maybe a couple of months ago. Okay, you got a bad bag. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. ordered it and it was horrible. Yeah, you got a bad bag. It was horrible. Breaded or um no, yeah, it was really? breaded and we oh, got a shit. sauce. Wow. I feel like the breaded ones are still okay, though. Usually, no, those no, are no, undefeated, bro. No, no, no. It was pretty good. It was pretty disgusting. Good. And now I'm actually over it. You're done, pizza. pizza. Yeah. I'm done. Jeez. I'm not touching it again. It's yeah. done. It's done. Yeah. I'm done. They have good pizza. <laughs> really. Thank you. Thank you. You're breaking his heart right now. Look at his face. <laughs> no, like, I'm sorry. I it's, used it's reliable. To, you know what? When yeah, I was in know? uni, yeah. I, I was having the chicken wings. The chicken wings were okay. bomb. Yeah. But last time I had it, no. It was awful, yeah? I'm just, yeah. I'm not going back. They have good panzerottis, though. Yeah, yeah I'll I like give them that. Yeah, they're yeah, panzerottis. The only thing I like is their garlic sauce. Oh, yeah. That oh. is undefeated. Okay. The garlic sauce okay. is... Okay. The they don't even make that in Listen. store. That's shit to them. Oh, so yeah, for sure. Really so it doesn't count. You're right, you're right. <laughs> you're right, but I just have to put it out there. They're pesto pizzas. They're pesto pizzas. Jordan. Uh, we, okay. You need where to give it, you, give, it up, <laughs> give it up. Where can you get a pesto yeah. pizza? Yeah. Wait, an pizza. Italian restaurant. Pizza pizza is your favorite Probably. Like, no, chain? It's the only, no, it's not my favorite. It's just like... I fend for them. Yeah, you really sla- ride for them. People slander them for me. I will. I, I'll, I'll like fend for them too, pizza? you know. I don't mind pizza pizza. <laughs> Their really. actual pizza is trash, but like the <laughs> other mind. things they have. I've actually never heard that really, before. I uh, actually don't mind pizza pizza. That is crazy. Like what other pizza like, can you compare so, it to? Um, excuse me, Domino's. Pizza um, Nova. Gino's? Everyone says that. You know what Gino's? 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 Pizza Nova. Gino's is Gino's Pizza Nova. Pizza Nova is number one. Pizza Nova is number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Yeah. If, if we you don't eat, eat a better pizza, pizza <laughs> than at Pizza Nova, you went to like a gourmet yeah, restaurant. Yeah, facts. facts. That's facts. That's the only time we're eating better. <laughs> And that's pizza, not a pizza. Lie. Thank you, like Tasha. Legit, that's cardboard. That's pure fat. That's, that's legit. It literally tastes like legit. wet paper. <laughs> like what I think wet legit. paper would taste like. But <laughs> that's what their crust tastes like. There's a controversial one. Pizza is so trash. Pizza Hut? Yeah. Not, that's not even not controversial. That yeah, it's trash. It's no, so no, trash. It's not that bad. It, it tastes bad. like deep fried pizza. It's the worst for me. Like it's the worst for me. It's so gross. Yeah, it's golden. Yeah, it it tastes it's deep fried. Golden. It's so oily. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's like I lotion, bro. Love it. Nah. Okay. <laughs> five is a scam, but we'll do that in another episode. <laughs> 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 all right, all right, all right. Um, another question. Our pizza. Same topic. Um, but do pineapples belong on pizza? No. Thank you. No. <laughs> thank you. No. Thank you. It is so awkward. So gross. Okay, good. Wait, do you like that? No. Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. okay. Yeah, that's that's what we all we all agree on. Have we been like two guests? Uh, that liked it. Yeah. Like, what, yeah. Like, what, yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. It was. Yeah, it was, it was, was the L only, I think. She's yeah. Weird, yeah. She is weird. She is weird. Aquarius energy. I would expect you to like that. Trust me. When it comes to wing eating. Are you? I say. I think I know you're gonna ask. Sorry. Are we? A flat? <laughs> <laughs> Are we the what? Are the drums? The drums. The drums. Flats. Okay. Drums. Flats. Thank you. Your drums. Come on. Flats. I don't. I don't get flats. flats. Yeah, I don't get it. I don't get it. Either. I don't well, get it. Flats. Well, flats. 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 Like, what are you eating? You can't dip. There's you can't a dip lot of. Drum. There's a lot of. Mm, you can't, can't dip, dip a drum. drum. <laughs> you can't dip the drum. Yeah. yeah. And drums always have a lot of fat. 
on it was the flat. It's the flavor. It's just straight meat. Talk it's just straight. There's no fat. It's straight mm-hmm. meat. Yeah, all that stringy stuff in it, too. <laughs> uh, I know. <laughs> yeah, I know. But whatever. Like, just bypass that. It's not that big of a deal. Yeah, that's <laughs> late. That's Close late. Your eyes. And, like, people get, like, all flats when they get, like, a pound. Oh, like, oh, you're wasting I'm your money. You're literally know? wasting <laughs> your money. Literally yeah. wasting your money. No. no. As long as they give yeah. me a pound of flats. Yeah. You know, it's they're not gonna give you a pound. They're gonna give you eight, eight, eight pieces. No. Of <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna give you eight pieces. Of flat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. I love flats. And okay, team flat. Yeah, sure. <laughs> team drums. Team drums. Drum hey. drums. There's just more meat on them. Mm. Like this you're getting more for your money. I guess. <laughs> Tasha. <laughs> I guess. But the the thing about drums is there's like mm. that piece at the top that's like. That's like you can't even eat it. Like so, I feel like it's an illusion. You're it's the same. <laughs> but you same can't really wrap it around. Can African you eat all of it, like the whole flat though? Can you really eat it all? I don't know that end no. part. Yeah, there's that, there's that yeah. trick yeah. where you like twist both sides. <laughs> 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 there's like a video. This like Russian guy. Yeah, yeah, it's a black guy, right? We actually don't need to. Oh my gosh. You don't. I just pull one wing, we pull the one bone out, and then you're straight. Yeah, yeah, it's like a drum. Exactly. I keep telling you guys, you guys understand one day still. But mm-hmm. for the final question, um, do pickles belong on burgers as a staple? Yeah. Yes. I feel like it, it. I like it. I like it. Really? Yeah. So you like you guys <laughs> like, like, <laughs> like you guys like pickles? Yes, yeah, you're yeah. disgusting. That's yeah. weird, eh? Pickles alone even are Where else would you put them on a hot dog? I don't eat pickles. I don't like pickles. Yeah. I don't like pickles at all. I think this is yeah. another one we pickles all agree on, so right? Pickles yeah. Pickles are I think that's the pickles reason. are mm. elite. Yeah, no, no. Mm. Pickles add like, you know, they spice things up. They make things different. Okay. I like on a chicken burger. No. Yeah. <laughs> It's not <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know what? That A and W chicken the, burger, the, the chicken buddy they burger. They put yeah, the chicken, one, the chicken buddy yes, burger. Yes, you're right. And they put, <laughs> they put, <laughs> <laughs> you know, but that's enough. That's all you need. That's all you need. <laughs> that's, that's I get cheese. Need. I get cheese. <laughs> Yo, see, that forget? chicken burger needs the pickle. I'm telling you, it's so good. You guys tried the Popeyes burger. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Yes, I did. No, I thought it was super overrated. Yeah, okay, but I think it's so, watered down because it's it Canadian. Good. Yeah, yeah there like, has to be America, something like. like juice that shit. Do you guys think so? Really? Yeah, yeah. Sure. Cause like I know our McDonald's is different with like the, you can't the calories and stuff. Like, the, and yeah. the grade of the meat mm-hmm. in Canada, um, in Can- Canadian McDonald's that they don't have in. In the States. American? Yeah. I don't think they have the McChicken. They don't have junior oh. chicken. Yeah, well, their junior, junior chicken. Don't don't our junior chicken. chickens, they're they McChicken. So mm. what's their McChicken? They don't really, like, our McChicken's different. Like, well, like, what we think is their McChicken, yeah. Is their McChicken, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's really weird. Okay, so, since we have a multicultural... Uh, panel with us today. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted yeah. to ask our guest: When was the last time you guys have been to your home country? Back to the what is your home country, and when have you been last time? And can you talk a little bit about your best and your least favorite experience? Tasha, do you want to start us off? Oh, I have never been. Oh, never. I do have plans. I was supposed to go to 2020, but you know the pandemic hit and everything. Yeah, so are we. You know, so, that's crazy. But my background is Jamaican. Um, growing up, my parents never took me, so that's why I've never yeah. been. And I do have plans of going one day. I think the best thing will probably be the jerk chicken. I'm really excited. <laughs> you like that. pork? I love, and you know, I don't like spicy food, eh? Yeah. But jerk chicken. Do you like pork? <laughs> No, I don't eat pork. Oh, okay, okay, okay. What, are you going to say jerk pork? The jerk pork is good. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> it's crazy. actually crazy. Right? I love it. I long for it. How about you, Corpse? Um, <clears throat> I'm Ganyan. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> 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 and uh, the last time, it was actually the first time I went, it was last summer in July. Oh, wow. June, June July. July. You went for a minute, no? Yeah, yeah. I was been, like almost a month. Yeah. Uh, crazy. It was a good time. Uh, um... I don't know, when, like, when I went there, it was kind of, like, weird. Like, I finally had that, like, feeling, like, this is, like, low-key home. Because, like, oh, everyone, yeah, like, everyone there is, like, 
like your from your culture and whatnot, and then all like the little like things that like my parents do or like family, family members, members do. Mm-hmm. Like as soon as like, oh, that makes sense. Like, this, is, <laughs> like, this is why. <laughs> that's why I think that was like my favorite part. Like it gave me like a, a better understanding of like my self identity. That's actually amazing. Wow. Worst thing probably the carbs. I I can't eat too much carbs. <laughs> and that's all they eat rice and. Yeah, I just need like a variety of food, but that sounds like me being a picky eater. But yeah, <laughs> did you ever go off on your own in Ghana? On my own, I went with my cousins a lot. Like, went to like little like bars and clubs and stuff. Oh, yeah. But like, oh, by myself was probably a bit hard from like where we were mm. to like get into the city. It's oh, probably yeah. like a, a quite a distance, so not really. Oh, yeah. mm. So what's it like clubbing? Clubbing in Ghana. It's pretty lit. A lot of like Azanto, a lot of like choreography, <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of dancing. Like, like how they show in the music video. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty lit. And I don't know, like from like here, everyone thinks like they have this like perception of like Africa. But when you go, it's like literally like here, like yeah. it's normal. Like yeah. for people- example, I saw Cardi B's um Instagram story like last year. Yeah. Of her going to Nigeria mm. and turning up, and she went to clubs, different clubs, and the clubs like look lit. They, like, they lit. Like, yeah. You know, clubs in America. Thing, like, yeah. Whoa, what's going on here? Like, uh-huh. like, like bottle- I haven't been to Africa in a while, but I was like, whoa, like, damn. Bottle like, service. Some places have like dress codes. Like, oh, yeah. wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, that's dope. Africa's gonna come up. It's gonna come up. Year. <laughs> it is. <laughs> damn, Low key, it is. It is. Yeah. yeah. Oh, like, did you guys hear about Offset and Cardi B breaking up? <laughs> Try it. Did. Man, it's awesome, <laughs> yeah. I yeah. didn't, but I honestly didn't think it was true just because of like all the shit from before. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I just thought like it's just another <laughs> another yeah. like media stunt mm-hmm. in a way. Mm-hmm. But yeah. This one might be it, yeah. You guys are saying? Yeah, know. no, yeah. She confirmed it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. But she's um I feel like she's gone back to him several times Jerk. before yes. yeah this might be strike three. like just in the yeah. course of their relationship like mm. it seems very on and off so mm. yeah but obviously if she's filing for divorce then it's yeah. over right. so it might be serious yeah, yeah. Okay, finally finally lost you finally took the l <laughs> <laughs> you remember last time she was gonna so he got caught for cheating or something but mm-hmm. after you posted a bunch of tweets mm. like it's like oh mm. Balls in my face. <laughs> yeah. I know. That, that, was, was, sorry, I was <laughs> that was so weird. I respect that. That was, <laughs> that was so strange. <laughs> the things you do to keep your girl. <laughs> every time you go on Twitter, like you see like someone, someone's lying on Twitter and like you just go through the replies, like the thread, and you just see someone post like, oh, so it's tweet. <laughs> <laughs> like, you automatically know like, oh yeah, he's lying. <laughs> <laughs> That was funny. <laughs> that was funny. Oh, that was Cap. funny. But yeah, it seems real. I think they're calling it quits. But I don't know. Oh, I don't know. As, oh, long as, they, as long as they make good music. I saw it coming, but I was rooting for them. Were you? Really? I was. Yeah. Oh, wow. I was. Okay. You were too? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, their baby is adorable. Oh, she's so cute. But you know what? Like, realistically, what, he has like three baby moms. Yeah. Like, four now. Like, four. It's about to happen and still. I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm ready for Quavo and Zoe. I'm for it. Yeah. I love they're that. Swaggy, they're so, so cute. They're so cute. Mm-hmm. They're so and they both play too much. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Like Yo, so, Kavana, do you want to tell us about Hush Puppy? Hush puppy, the Nigerian, <laughs> the normal Nigerian man. <laughs> Wait, I don't know. Guys, I don't know who Hush puppy Nigerian. is. Can you give me a background? He was like, I can't. He's a social media star. He's like a social okay. media star. Okay. And no one knew where he, like, he's really rich. Okay. And no one knew where he was getting his money from. <laughs> okay. And he was like, really like quiet about it. And then he was like, not going quiet to. quiet about being rich. Not quiet about being rich. But quiet about, about like how he has come gets, up. Okay. <laughs> Funniest thing, like, he would always post these, like, motivational things, like, started from the bottom, blah, blah, blah. Oh, my God. (laughs) So he was, like, going to Dubai and all these, like, places, like, spending all this money. But low-key, this guy was scamming, like, old people in the States for, like, their retirement (laughs) funds and stuff. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. Like, out of millions and millions of dollars. Holy shit. Made a lot of money. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, They arrested him in Dubai then got extradited to the States. Yeah. Yeah, they they get in his ass. Oh, they actually, they actually did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Funny, yeah. Though, yeah. <laughs> they're, they're looking hold on, hold on. He's Nigerian. <laughs> <laughs> That's your <laughs> man. No, no. 
love it, love it, love it, love it. That's funny. Oh, Classic Nigerian. Yeah. Like, There's yeah. a lot of successful people coming out of Nigeria, though. Come on. There's also yeah. a lot of scams yeah. coming no. out of Nigeria. What do you mean? Yeah. Are they sending you? He's funny tonight. Oh, yeah. Usman? Oh, yeah. Um, Burner Boy? Whiskey? Hey. I don't know if I don't know if like um Ghana's coming any of those artists, but I don't know. But you know what? There was there was this guy actually in. that came out of Nigeria. He's still alive today, and he created the world's fastest computer. And he works <laughs> for I think Microsoft. Damn. And he was like he was like a whiz kid. Like I think he skipped like most of grade school, mm. and then they paid for him and his entire family to study at Harvard. Jeez. Yeah, yeah he was out of Nigeria, and yeah. I think he studied like union like. I don't know when he was like, like 15 I, I was about to say like crazy like grade that. 7 like. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah crazy a lot of Nigerians are like hard workers though other than the scammers it's really like you're a scammer you're a hard worker <laughs> <laughs> nice balance <laughs> <In between. laughs> one of the two <laughs> do you want to counterpart with some Ghanaian Ghanaian sorry I couldn't even say it Skepta uh, Excellent. Skepta, <laughs> Skepta Rema Davido, just saying. What's that? What's the dude from no, he's all the Nigerian? He's Nigerian. He's like he's like UK Nigerian though. Yeah. yeah. Satan named Nigerian also. Oh, for God. Does he claim like Nigeria yeah. like a lot? Yeah, Skepta does. does. Yeah, he does. The rest Skepta of them, Skepta not does. really. Skepta, Skepta does. 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 claim Nigeria? Not really. No. I've heard him. No. Like, I've never heard, heard him. Really. Really. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, you guys only listen to the, to the club scenes. You don't listen to rap though. I guess, like, I guess, Skepta, I guess. he's African, yeah, but. Is Stormzy Gangy? Stormzy's oh, Gangy. We, yeah. we have Stormzy. Ah, we, have, we have Virgil. Virgil okay. Abloh. But you know you what? Know, that, you know, <laughs> yeah. That's how we cast that guy. <laughs> that guy. Hey. <laughs> He's a controversial guy. He's a controversial guy. I think Idris yeah. Elba is Ghanaian. I think so. Hey. Yeah. Is he really? Wow. I think so. Don't quote think me. He might be, he okay. might be, uh, he might if Idris Elba <laughs> is actually from Ghana. I think he's Ghanaian. You won if he's from Ghana. I would have him being Ghanaian. Even just his demeanor is very... It's not Nigerian. It's not Nigerian. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, like... That's actually true. That sounds Ghanaian. Does it? Okay, yeah, let me see. It sounds Ghanaian. <laughs> Us Ghanaians, we're, we're the pioneers, you know? Like, <laughs> we start and we have to give to you to, to go run with it, you know? You guys copy our language, our food? We don't... Our, our totally music? different mm. language. Our, our okay, how do you say? The music. How do you say welcome in Ghana? Akwaba. What's called? You say Akabo in um Nigerian. Okay, but they're all similar language. Yeah, we're we're from the same us. group of people, though. Yeah, yeah, because we copy. Well, we didn't copy. <laughs> we come <laughs> from the same cloth. But music-wise, all this Afro beats and where, where did it all start? Nigeria. Ah. In Ghana. Nigeria. Where's Don't play Ghanaian yourself. Artists. Ghanaian artists. <laughs> yeah. 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 I actually yeah. thought yeah. that Wizkid was yeah. I was gonna say that. Yeah. Yeah. I thought Wizkid was Ghanaian was, for so got, long. Got, 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 but like, I don't know why. The thing is, so, I I, I know, think why like what's his name Nigerian music yeah. is like more popular because they what's speak more English in it, right? <laughs> like our our music, it's more in our language. So like, do you have like a like a is it called pigeon, Mike? Is that what it's called, pigeon? Yeah. Yeah. Do you have like a version of that? We have our like our own. It's similar though. It's like the same thing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm. But Interesting. I don't know. Nigerian music is mostly in English, and our music is like in the language we speak. Tree, so oh. does it really resonate? Authenticity, but. Like Afro beats became popular because of like Ozonto music, mm -hmm. you know the Ozonto, Ozonto dance or whatnot, yeah. and that comes from Ghana. Like <laughs> all that like high life, hip life, like that's yeah, all. It all stems yeah. from Ghana. <laughs> Ghana yeah. And we just we have to sprint so you guys can walk. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> anyways, guys, anyways, have you guys listened to any albums? Do you have any favorite albums of the year so far from quarantine? Mm -hmm. Mm. Hmm. That's a good question. That is a great album. question. Albums, uh, albums. Wanna? I could go first. Gotta, Mine is oh, yeah. Uzi's album. That was like pre quarantine. That was right when it started. Wait, that, who's that Uzi? That reminds me of quarantine. Uzi, Uzi's album. That was before quarantine, Just I feel before. like. Yeah, well, I remember really? we were bumping that. We were going to volleyball. Yeah. You keep up the deluxe drop in quarantine. Because I yeah, remember yeah, yeah. bumping your in quarantine yeah. in my house a lot. A lot or driving on road, yeah. On road, a lot. Yeah, <laughs> pull up everywhere you go. Yes, mm. these blaring, blaring. What about you, Tasha? I'm super late, so I'm still listening to pop. No. Well, I'm not late. I, I just I take that's my time. On. That's where you're album, on. That's where you're on. You know? Yeah, I'm listening to yeah. listen to pop smoke. Um, who that's the album. Man. Future's album to the high life. Is that what it's called? I forgot. Which one? I, the high life or uh. 
I have two comfortable. I have. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I, I missed that. So. Wow. Uh, I, I, I downloaded it, but I didn't listen You know, to I'm it. not a future fan, and that's a good I, album. I did fuck with that. Um, it's a legend. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he's toxic. Yeah. <laughs> you love a toxic king. Um, <laughs> um, you know who else I've been listening to? Mm. And he's a Toronto artist. Free A. Have you guys? Oh, he's Ganyan. He's yes, <laughs> the he same is. last name. I, I went to um, school with him. Really? I did, and he like he used to live like right beside me. Mm. <laughs> I remember he'd always like, or I don't know, his unit would always have parties. I don't mm. know if it was him doing. That. Anyways, yeah, his album, you guys should definitely check it out. And he's mm. been dropping like singles here and there for I feel like an album's coming. But mm. his stuff, Isn't enough, he? enough and free. Mm. Gold, I love, and he signed for Floyd Mayweather. Oh yeah! Wow, yeah, he yeah. just got signed. He did yeah. his, wow, uh, good for him. When he found McGregor, he did his like uh, his uh, what do you Intro? call it? En- en- entrance, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. Whoa, Whoa. Toronto. So he's from Toronto. Oh, yeah. so you've heard of him? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, dope, dope, dope. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's yeah. his name? Free A. Free A. So F R I Y I E. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Okay, okay. See my last yeah. name legit. That's, <laughs> That's your last name? name? Yeah. Wow. It's a free, but he just put free uh, in it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. His music, I'm telling you guys, and he just like just released a few like singles. Check it <laughs> out. Oh, it's so good. Definitely. Out of Toronto. Damn. Hey. Doesn't get much better, right? So. So what about you, Kobeta? <laughs> I don't know, I listen to a lot of like old music, so everything's <laughs> 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 outdated. But what's job new? I don't know if you guys know him. His name is Nick Hakim. He's mm-hmm. like a like an R and B like type singer. Okay. But yeah, he, he dropped the album called "Would This Make Me Good." It's pretty good. Answer is yes. It's really good. <laughs> <laughs> it might. Natasha, you mentioned um Pop Smoke's album, right? Yeah. So how do you feel about listening to his album now that he's dead? <laughs> Like so music, sad. yo, he would have been so big, uh, honestly. Yeah, and I blue. remember, I remember, I heard blue. like his, cause like I, 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 okay. So the first song I heard was "Welcome to the Party," right? Uh-huh. That's the song everybody knew. Mm-hmm. Then my boy put me on, and was like, he was just playing music. I'm like, yo, who's this? Is this Fifty? Mm. And he's like, nah, nah, it's pop. I'm like, what? <laughs> yo, no. okay, nah, run his tracks. So we were like listening to it. And I'm like, oh my God, he literally sounds like 50 back in the day. Yeah. yeah. Back in the day. I'm like, nah, he's going to be big. And then ever since I've been hooked. And I really couldn't believe it when like I saw that headline. Uh, I know. I was, it was like, weird. What? Uh, I was like, what? <laughs> what? Like, oh. How? Right. Wow. Yeah. It's so sad. But you know what was crazy? All the girls that came out of the woodwork and were like, Pop, I love you. <laughs> and they had you the know, they posted the pic. Yeah, our relationship yeah. forever. They posted DMs with them, like anything going even yeah. deep. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> videos, DMs, everything. pictures, everything. Everything. <laughs> everything was coming out. <laughs> they love you more when you die. Oh yeah, my god. Yeah, that was crazy. That was he funny. was really out here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He was a thought, no. for real. <laughs> <laughs> but how do you guys feel about the album, though? Like, now he's dead. Like, mm. still releasing, I love it. Technically releasing I love it. it. I wish that he... Throws. I wish... It makes me sad, because, like, like you said, Tasha, like, he was about to blow up, mm. and, like, I wish he could have gotten... He could have been alive to ha- get that recognition mm. and to get that, like, accolade. Mm. Um, And I don't know, like, if you guys feel this way, but, like, I feel like listening to his album now... Mm. It definitely makes me feel more like emotion. Sorry, emotional in a way. Like not emotional, but like I feel more I like. It. You think about what it could have been. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. yeah. And it, it makes me feel more like attached, kind of like to the music. Yeah, knowing that he's not around to like make yeah, it anymore. Exactly. So now I'm like, this is what we have. Like this it's so all. good. Like yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I didn't sure. like when people were coming out and saying like. Oh, this is not pop. This is so different, right? Tay But when he was alive, though, what was everybody saying? That he just keeps ma- remaking the same, same song, song. Yeah. over and over yeah. and over again, right? Yeah. Everyone was complaining about that, and he actually took like, like those complaints into consideration yeah. and put together this amazing album. Yeah. And everyone's like, "Oh, it's not the it's not the real pop." Yeah. <laughs> I feel that the the ad libs, like mm-hmm. he's not gonna put in this like this like. He's not the one putting the albums in; it's someone else producing it for him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's not yeah. getting the final say on his music. So, it, do you yeah. really say it's his music? Like, I, yeah, it's that's him a, on the track. I mean, I'm sure they, you know, took his 
direction into consideration because they would have had an idea. A t- like his team would have had an idea of what he wanted to produce. I also think because mm-hmm. he has a lot of features, but I'm thinking like, what did they really have to work with? You know, what if they yeah. didn't have a lot mm-hmm. to work with? Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. Like I even Juice know. World, like he's releasing tracks. Even off X, like people are getting like, X on oh, there, yeah. and, like on their on their albums. Well, we not like two X features on his album. Yeah. I'm like yo, like damn, yeah. like, what's going on? You just Taking these guys that just whatever work can they put in this, put aside, that you 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 taking you reaping benefits on them that they're dead. Like they don't get to say they don't have like Frank Ocean for example. Yeah, like he's a perfectionist and he has, he probably like made so many music that he's not gonna put out there. Mm-hmm. What if it dies and then randomly all you see is like he's releasing yeah stuff. Frank Ocean Frank Ocean like yeah. I don't know. I don't know. That's a good point. They don't even own their music <laughs> nine times out of ten. Mm. So it's not even their say. Yeah. Like, they do that with Michael Jackson yeah. too. Yeah, like that's not even their music to call. Yeah. Like, like the call on that Drake feature. Oh my gosh, yeah, <laughs> yeah that was so weird. Yeah. Like hearing him and like seeing his name on the album, like mm. what? Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm sure Michael Jackson would not like that. Yeah, I think there's two sides to the coin there, Mike. Like I agree with what you're saying, but then I also think like I don't know. They have this like body of work that like if they don't put it out, it's kind of just like gone to waste yeah. kind of like yeah. you know what i mean and like i get it like they're not there to like put that music out themselves how can we really know it's a product of like what they like it's a it's their product yeah. but mm. it still adds to their legacy no, you does. know like so. so it's still part of their kind yeah of like of everyone is really fucking with this album yeah. and like mm-hmm. it sucks that yeah it's really sad that he's dead but like it brought him so much like it gave him so much more, yeah, more reach you know yeah, like fine. Yeah. I feel like the true fans will always like they'll appreciate it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, for sure. Like, you know? Yeah. Yeah. All the like <laughs> same, and, and I was that, like, that's that goes, me. And that goes with X and that goes with Juice World and that goes with, with Michael. Any like, posthumous every, yeah, every, work, yeah. yeah. Everything. Yeah. Like the real fans will appreciate it and everyone else will, will say what they have to say. Yeah, mm-hmm. you know? That's what yeah, it comes down to. Hologram. That was dope. Did you just start doing that? That one's a little. That's that's what we're getting into. Now we're getting into some different territory. (laughs) Anyways, guys, did you see that Bobby Schmurda got denied, bro? Oh, yeah. Free Bobby. Which is crazy because I don't know. Has he been misbehaving in prison? Why would they deny that? Apparently, he he, he had like a lot of like priors in prison. So, like, getting caught with like drugs, fighting, whatnot. Oh my god, yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, that means he hasn't been on his best behavior. No, nah. probably not. <laughs> uh, okay, well, no, he's coming out soon, so I guess yeah. we just gotta Next be patient. Year. Yeah. Another year, yeah. <laughs> you think he should have snitched like 6'9? No, I think he's a solid one for yeah. for taking that time so his boy could do this. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. that's crazy. That's yeah. love. That's, that's love. actually love, yeah. So, you, so you think 6 is wrong for what he did? Yes. <laughs> okay, you know what? He's wrong. Yeah. His, he's not wrong for what he did. Yeah. He's not his wrong for what he different. did in isolation. Okay, I'll say that yeah. for what he did, like I would have done what he did. But at the same time, <laughs> I'm not in the streets. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm yeah, not claiming yeah. 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 to be like you yeah. know mm-hmm. who, who yeah. I'm not. Yeah. He was out. He was out here in our face. Did you really Blast. believe him though? Nobody believed him. But if you're gonna <laughs> say that stuff, yeah. if you're gonna say that stuff, say it with your chest. Yeah. Yeah. Do mm-hmm. it, yeah. right? So like, but he did though. I think he did. He did what? He did follow through with it. Mm. Until, no, until he didn't. They, they, I think his crew, his crew attacked him. They beat him up. They kidnapped him. Yeah, and what? Him. That's that's they, the street. They that's fucked the street. his baby mama. Okay, yeah. That's the street. But like, you okay. did, you knew he wasn't. Was you so knew he wasn't. You handle okay. that in the street. You don't go to the court to make them like hand, handle yeah, that. Yeah, right? you okay, know yeah. Okay, yeah, but no. Yeah. <laughs> I hear that. I hear that. But <laughs> but the FBI said, okay, yeah, we already yeah. got you guys on wiretap. Like. You're like you're, you're, fucked. you're saying it was they, his only way out, Mike. Yeah, yeah. They like, uh, they're no, like, there's oh, no. You're when, you, fucked. when you tap into the streets, there's no way out. So you just that's accept it. it. So okay, yeah. So, yeah, you do you accept it. So they just okay, yeah. So <laughs> you, should have, you, should have, you, should you do. That's a street. He would have. He would have been more respected. I'm not a part of the streets. Yeah, yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't need yeah, to tell yeah. nothing. No. Okay, I can ride you out, no problem. But if I'm gonna say like, you know, I'm in this. I'm rocking with you. You think? You think? What's his name? Uh, what's that? What's that big Hispanic guy? Um, uh, Escobar. You think Escobar was out here snitching on no, his? No, no. Uh, is that Escobar? Yeah, Cabo Escobar, yeah. 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 You think he was out here doing that? Yeah. You think he was out here doing that? Yeah. No. Definitely not. No. If you're gonna claim the streets, claim the streets. We can't flip back yeah. and forth. Even if you're, even if you dudes do you dirty, they could do yeah. you dirty, bro. They could wipe out your whole family. You don't go. <laughs> Damn. No, no, you do not. I you know. I really have to saying. understand that when yeah. you join the streets. Yeah. <laughs> you have to understand that. You gotta retaliate. You, you have to handle things in the streets. Yeah, you cannot turn yeah, yeah. to the police okay. and say, "Can yeah. you clean up my mess?" No, 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 no. <laughs> That's how Damn. I feel. 
I agree still. <laughs> <laughs> I was surprised. It's just kind of a facade, you know? Yeah, it was. Yeah. It was. It was selling it. It was selling it beautiful. But but he was, he's selling it to the public. And, yeah. and look, but he still, uh, he still has his bus. Like, and he's still fucking around. He Does came he out really of jail. Does he really have his bus? Still? Like, he had a bus when he first came out. But yeah. does he have a bus right now? He might be done right now. I don't think he's I think done. He's, well, he like, dropped the album, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Nobody, <laughs> nobody fucked with that. Nobody fucked with that. They blacklist and like they start like, but he still sold. Like he ended up selling more like the week after. Well, after really? I started complaining about it. Yeah. Fam, I don't. Oh, wow. I, I didn't even know he posted. Yeah. yeah. I didn't, I didn't like that's how. That's how. Like, that's how. Like, <laughs> it was kind of fucked. So I didn't know he dropped. Yeah. If you're not going on academics page or yeah, something, yeah. you're not gonna see. I follow. Nine. I follow. I follow academics. Yeah. I think I do. I don't know. I'm not. I do. Yeah. yeah. And that's the only reason I knew about but, it. Yeah. yeah. No. I don't. I really. Don't yeah. Because Apple Music know. hit it. Like they. Spotify. They didn't post it. Right? It's not on Spotify, right? But Apple Music hit it, right? Mm-hmm. But now that I go to Apple Music, I see it right there. It's featured now. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, I guess when he complained, they, they like they fixed up for him. Well, yeah. yeah made it blatant still. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's kind of blatant though. Yeah, it's not fair. Actually, it's, uh, it's not fair. I mean, <laughs> he does not belong in the hip hop world. Yeah. Yeah, and like, someone with it, some powers is saying something. Is, like, like trying to like he does not belong irks him out. There. He needs to go. He needs to figure it out and find something else because just make the Latina music. Yeah, yo. Yeah. <laughs> No, let's stick to that reggaeton. Like, you coming over here for? But I actually think <laughs> I actually think he makes some good like reggaeton songs. Like, I haven't he heard some... any sort of like Spanish Seriously, music that he's put out. The one on his album was actually yeah. fire. Which one? Like, it's called Bebe or something like that. Okay, I'm gonna listen to oh that. Oh my gosh, fire! I literally have not heard fire any of his music except yeah. for that one Fox. fucking stupid song. <laughs> you know the one fucking stupid. Oh my god, I can't. Yeah. That song is so hard. But even that, I'm like, okay, I, actually, I don't... two. What's the other one with Nicki Minaj? The yeah, other song. Nicki Minaj. You oh my god, one what's that song with Nicki Minaj? Pussy got that wet, wet, got that super soak. I fucking hate that song. That sounds a banger, though. Oh, it's yeah. a new one? Okay. I think that's a newer one, but yeah, no, I can't say any boys. Oh, that's screaming. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He broke the record for most like viewed live Instagram live. He, he broke it from Tory Lanez. Of course, Lanes. of course. He beat out Tory Lanez. But yes, I mean, it's not, it's not, a, it's not like you know something he works hard for. It's not something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. People also need to stop giving just, him clout. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I was gonna so say that. Much clout, like yeah, deed on clout with him. Yeah. I think it's I think it's he's a know. troll and they like what he does. Yeah, like he it's because he's a troll. Like, it's because he's a troll. He trolls like and people like all celebs like Meek Mill. He, he was biting it for a sec. Dirk like when he dropped that track with Drake and he mm-hmm. dropped that line. Mm-hmm. Oh, what was the line? Oh, that line. Please don't play a little boy in the club. Oh. <laughs> we do not listen to rest. <laughs> <laughs> then after six nine goes to O Block again. Then he goes no he goes to Lil Dirk's um I think it was his cousin. Yeah. It's because it's on um, grave and he's like praying on his gra- cousin's grave. I'm like, yo, guys, that's oh, such what a the shit. Fuck? He's such a shit yeah. disturber. Like, yeah, I remember he even no visited skin. Nipsey's grave. I was like, boy, did it really? If he was yeah, alive. He was, so. he was at the mural. He was at the Come mural. on. He at the mural. Come <laughs> on. <laughs> yeah. And he knows. He knows. He knows. You know, you know, Nipsey you know. <laughs> wants nothing to do with yeah. <laughs> Like. <laughs> Not an ounce. He just knows bro. that people, like, people are gonna. But yeah, yeah. yeah. He's gonna piss people off. Yeah. Like, bro, oh, what's it going up to now? Like, what's beefing now? Like, what's happening with this beef now? Yeah, that's a new way to be like a successful artist. Yeah, have mm-hmm. to have like some type of like troll or like clout behind you. Yeah. <laughs> you think? You think the Tory and Meg thing was a controversy thing? The way it played yeah. out, yeah, I like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you think the way it's playing think, out right now? You think, it's like, like, you think it's a tactic or a move, a chess move? Who knows? Know. You think, or yeah. you think but it's like, a real deal? It if is. someone shot someone, shouldn't that be like left in like the legal system? Yeah. Not right. like explaining like, yourself through an album. I find that really weird. Like, yeah, that's shady. <laughs> yeah, it's I don't really like that. weird. Why isn't he? Why? What are the charges? That's what I want to know. Yeah, I don't, yeah, know. I don't, think, I don't know. think there are any. Yeah, like right. So but like, but Meg did say she didn't like admit to being shot. Yeah. She was cl- blaming it on like broken glass. Because she didn't oh, want no trouble with the police, and mm-hmm. like she didn't want other, her other friends to also be in trouble, and for the police to find out. Or I don't know if the police did know that there was. A so we didn't get charged. No, they, they did. They did. That's they why they got did, arrested. Right? For it. Yeah. I think yeah, that was yeah, the whole yeah. reason. Yeah. Yeah. But I think possession. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, she didn't want any more trouble than what they were already in. And, yeah, which I understand. I I get that. Yeah, that I, get I, get, I really yeah. I don't I don't know about that situation. I'm not gonna speak too much on that. But oh no, did, did she respond to album at all? To his album. Like, did she go on Instagram? It's been, it's been two days. It's been two days, right? Yeah, but yeah. that's enough time. Like, Megan, uh, she's always on her stuff. Like, she's always, like, paging. I think it's best for her to, to not see anything. Is she really always paging? I yeah, feel she's like she's paging. super chill. Like, even when, like, no, like, even when all the rumors, like, people are clowning her. 
on social media. Yeah, because imagine how many people were talking. Yeah, about that one it. was yeah. actually like, like I understand. that one blew out of the yeah. water. Yeah. But I think this is the first time Meg has actually been in some mix up because normally right? she's yeah. with everybody, right? Yeah. yeah. So it's funny. I find it. I find it entertaining. You think she's going to run back to... As bad as it is, as she is. Why do you think that's funny? Why do you think it's funny? It's not funny, necessarily. It's more entertaining than funny still. Just because of, like... It has your attention. Yeah, and it's not... I feel like it's not being taken... Taking it serious. Like, I don't know why. Someone shot someone. Yo, her career could have been done. Mm-hmm. Right. She could have died. <laughs> she yeah. twerks. She yeah. twerks. Yeah. Pro- like, she's a professional twerk. twerk. No she's feet. a professional twerker. Yeah. She's a professional rapper. She twerks on the side. Oh, okay. That was pre shooting or post shooting? What? The WAP video. Yeah, WAP video is post shooting. Yeah. yeah, impressive. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's how like, yeah. like, like people are like, yo, what? Like, how did you recover that quick? Did you yeah. Yeah. It didn't. It didn't hit no any way. limbs, tendons, nothing. It just went through flesh. Like both in her foot. foot. She in her had foot. two. I know, right? <laughs> I know. Your foot. Your foot. Your foot. And I also heard it was both her feet, no. or was it just one it foot? One foot. Oh, it was one bullets. foot. Okay, okay. One foot, two bullets. Oh, yeah. It's but crazy. I don't know what kind of bullet it was. I don't know. Yeah, that's some like very strategic right? placement I don't know, for it to. Did like, you guys listen to the album? Flesh. I wonder. I did not. Who's that album? Tori's album. Are you crazy? I'm not giving that boy no shame. Same. True. I'm not. Excuse me, an album, and that's how you respond. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and it probably talks about it through all the songs. You gotta listen to it. Nah. Every single song? I'm, I'm not listening to it. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not listening to it. Every single song. But there I'm is one song where, like, it comes out. I'm uh, everyone it. that, like, Chris comes out. Like, every single person <laughs> that criticizes me. He came out. JoJo. He told us, like, hey, like, are you gonna take me off a song that. White JoJo? Yeah, yeah. Like, oh. <laughs> JoJo had him on a song. Yeah. White JoJo. Yeah. 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 I love JoJo. I fucking love her. She was like my just like a too late. yeah, <laughs> yeah. Lo- a little too late. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I so, love it. Yeah, so he's like, oh, like you paid me fifty k for your to be on a song with you, and you're taking me off it, like. And it was your most popular it's her song. song. Like, it's her song. But like, oh, that's your most popular. Like, it's, I know, it's, but it's, it's just the like, principle, right? Exactly. It's, it's yeah. the principle behind it. Why, wait, why, why did he come for her? Because apparently she took him off her song, like her most popular song. And he's like, oh, I got you those views, and your label paid me fifty. So he was just coming for everyone. He's just coming yeah, for people. Coming yeah. He came out J.R. Smith. Yeah, that was yeah. weird. <laughs> <laughs> he came out J.R. Smith. So J.R. Smith commented on it. Yeah. He came out Chance the Rapper, called him relevant. What? <laughs> came out. He kinda is. Yeah. <laughs> he so is he was doing it. everything. Yeah, it's coming out everyone. At but criticism. but addressing the situation. The situation. Yeah. <laughs> He was doing everything because he, he released a whole album, right? And still nobody knows what happened. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So to me, what was the album for? Why, yeah. you, why are you releasing a whole album? And just, just to capitalize off the situation. Just to capitalize off the situation. Why am I going to listen to it? Why am I going to listen to it? Yeah. Because if yeah. he shot that girl? Don't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Loki has had the most interesting year out of anyone. I know. because He was a hero. I was like, I remember a roller coaster. Yeah, I remember Justin Bieber went on his life, or Justin Bieber was coming out humbly, like, oh, like praying for him. He's like, oh, I pray you have a good year. Like, wow. <laughs> you do good. You do good. Oh, and he dropped a line about Kylie, the like, beautiful face or something. I'm like, oh, that's gonna go. Like, that's so Wait, wrong. Wait, he did what? <laughs> yeah, like, he was like, oh, big enough Kylie and stuff. Like, come about like a pretty on face. On the album? Yeah, on the album. And I'm like, oh, he's gonna get slanted for this. <laughs> he's gonna. You just digging yourself. You spitting, man. I just have no uh, comment. I heard one song. You spitting still. Like it sound good. It's just flowing. You just flowing still. You <laughs> 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 just flowing. Bro. I really couldn't care <laughs> less. <laughs> you know, I answer the controller when it comes on. That's the controller when it comes on. Of course, I am. Okay. That's the controller. That's that's Drake. That has nothing to do with Tory. No, no, his version. His version. Oh, I've never heard his version. So I've never heard the Tory Lanez version. You have definitely heard it. Have I? You have definitely heard it. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay, is that the one that's like no one girl can satisfy me? That's the one, right? Yeah. 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 Oh yes, I have. It Listen. doesn't. It doesn't beat the Drake and Pop conversion. Oh my god, that is that's number one. That's elite. that's number one. And so then it's Tory and then I normally I, I stick to the elites. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna okay. confuse myself. <laughs> I, I don't what about that like Tory song? The um, what he did with T Pain. The sample I forgot. What I was about Sprunger. Sprunger. Yeah, Jerry Springer. Yeah, Jerry Springer. Yeah. Mm. I'll bump. Pre-shooting Megan music. Okay, yeah, that's where it goes. I'll bust that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, pre-shooting. It's the same guy, though. I'm supposed to 
who you really were, right? Does that go for Chris Brown too? Is that the same for Chris Brown also? Chris Brown, um, yeah. you know, I'm not even. I don't want to touch on that too much. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't really. No, I don't really bump Chris Brown like that. That first yeah, I don't even classic. listen to his music. <laughs> yeah, like for he, me to consider him <laughs> as an artist, that yeah. yeah, I would add on my playlist. I don't even he's listen talented. to his music. I will say he is he's one a, of the most. Yeah, he's talented. Talented. He can sing. He can dance. He can. Act, he can do anything you throw at him. Mm-hmm. But to be completely honest, I'm just not a fan of his style of music. And he's been making the same kind of music since he was like 16. That's true. So I like his early, me. early music. Like when I was in middle yeah. school, yeah. like a yeah. like Kiss Kiss and Yo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. 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 Yeah, no. Yeah, fact. But um, yeah, I wouldn't say Chris Brown is even someone I would bump too, too heavy. Same. I'm trying to get into UK music. Music. Uh, that's where it's at, Tasha. Yeah, it's uh, actually where it's at. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, so. I love UK music. Yeah. This is, yes. This is uh, right now. It is. Shout out 81. <laughs> Head is. <laughs> Head is Ghanaian. Ghanaian. Well, there we go. <laughs> yo, I, I, yo, oh, he is? Wow. Ghanaian, yeah. Okay. Okay. There's a lot of Ghanaian words in this song. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> Okay. Is um <laughs> Jay Huss? Is he from he's Ghana? Ghanaian. He's no, he's Gambian, I think. Okay. Oh, he's yeah. Gambian. Gambian, yeah. I thought he was too. It sounds like it. Yeah, mm. yeah. He's That's Gambian. a big one. How do you? How do you? a big one. Hedy's a yeah. big one. Stormzy. Yeah. He's about Hedy. to drop. He's about to drop too. I always tell Mike, like, ever since I met him, he looks so much like Hedy yeah. One. Like, every time I see him now, <laughs> Michael. <laughs> I, I just, just like seeing him with them. Like, he looks like Hedy One. It is, but, like, come on. And the eyes, too, I think. And the eyes, too. And he's fried? Yes. And he's fried? Yes. Yeah. 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 Sure, exactly. Oh, my God. Right? Uh, oh my god! <laughs> now I can't listen to his music without thinking of Michael. Like, literally. Oh my god. What? 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 That's crazy. Uh, That's not what I. Like still. I'm not gonna lie, still. He claims it too, yeah. yeah, yeah you're That's a heady to you. So, so. Thank you. Um. <laughs> <laughs> he kind of talks like him too. He Like a little bit. Jordan, doesn't he kind of talk like him? So, so, so every now and then he, yeah, he slurs. Yeah, he yeah, slurs. Yeah, he slurs. Yeah. slurs. Uh, is Hetty from the UK? Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> All right, guys. We're gonna get a little touchy. Yeah. How do we feel about the Brianna Taylor decision? They need to burn um, that shit down. Yeah. yeah. It's fucked up. Burn still. it all to the fucking burn ground. Yeah. Yeah, bring yeah, the whole police force out there. Still. Mm-hmm. Nobody. That shit can't be reformed. That's that's not there. so fucking crazy, bro. Can't be reformed. Like police officers, they charged to shoot up your crib, mm-hmm. and he, nothing's gonna happen. You're worried about other people's yeah, charged for like property. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're property. not even worried about other lives. You're worried uh, about only property. One of them got only one. But I will say this though: apparently, it's because mm-hmm. the husband shot first. So what? You're in that's self defense, though. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. self defense. They, they didn't, they didn't, I heard that they did not even identify themselves as police officers. Mm-hmm. They just until it was all said and done. They were dressed in regular clothes. They weren't in uniform. And in the states, you are allowed to shoot at intruders. Yeah, they why they, they ride for their Second Amendment oh, right, like my right bro. to defend my property, so my how, right to defend myself. Saying, oh, but not when black people are defending themselves bro. and defending their property. So, and they they pulled up in regular clothes. Like, are you kidding me? Yeah, that's yeah, some that's, bullshit. Are you that's me? fucked up. Still, I didn't even know that. Nah, it's a setup team. Definitely, right? some bullshit. It's weird right. timing too, huh? that they 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 released the charges. Yeah. Weird timing too. Mm. When like shit's finally kind of getting like, yeah, like uh, the U.S. like Supreme Court decisions coming up, mm-hmm. it's like oh let's just drop it, mm-hmm. and like if you because the family they got a they won their um, wrongful death like lawsuit right, yeah. Yeah, so that obviously settlement. shows like something wrong happened, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. but then you you charge him for missing. Yeah, <laughs> like, Wait, essentially what? make it make sense. Mm-hmm. It makes <laughs> no black too. sense. Who, the yeah the attorney general yeah, yeah. it's black too it's crazy who called the, who called the yeah shot? yeah it was black too but like he's a Trump yeah. like he's um he's a Trump yeah guy. Trump. Well, the attorney general yeah. that's yeah. why Trump, Trump Trump is why you know Trump I heard like I saw this recent I don't know like when they ask him questions and stuff. Mm. And what is that called? A press. A press. <laughs> <laughs> press conference. Yeah, press conference. Yeah, it was a so, press conference. Yeah. So, <laughs> <laughs> so, 
<laughs> and they were asking him, like, so how do you feel about, like, the decision ruling on Brianna Taylor? And he's like, oh, well, you know, I don't really know too much about it. So I'm just going to let the people yeah. know. The president of the country doesn't know, like, the whole catalyst of the Black what? Lives Matter situation Literally. in Literally. America. Uh, that oh, you know. speaks what? volumes. That saying, the main guy is a Trump supporter. I'm like, you know what? No, this guy no. Yeah. And this yes. guy's uh, like, I feel like he's being protected. Oh, he probably got bought out. Mm-hmm. Like, they probably bought it out. It makes no sense. Why? It's all smoke and screens. Mm-hmm. Your corruption. Like, even though, um, apparently, like, I was just going to say theories, and apparently, like, the whole black black slave movement was the, was the best thing that ever happened to Trump because it was all, under a lot of fire and heat. Uh-huh. And like well, the handling of coronavirus and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. So apparently, like when Black Lives Matter happened, when the shooting happened, everyone just completely forgot about that. It was just all about Corona. Matter. Yeah, mm-hmm. about how he handled Corona handled and uh-huh. all, all the mm-hmm. allegations before. Everyone mm-hmm. was like under the rug. And, like, That's what I'm saying. No Black oh, Lives Matter. Oh, you mean why they they released the word they 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 charged that officer now? Yeah, out of all timing, when like strategic COVID's getting worse. Mm-hmm. They're they're picking a new uh, election Supreme uh, Supreme Court justice mm-hmm. when like everyone's complaining. Hey, when Obama tried to do that in 2016, you said like that was wrong, and now all of a sudden you're doing it yourself. But like if, and then I don't know if this was true, but like 24 hours before it happened, the uh, was it Louisville, Kentucky? Mm. They posted um, a what do you call it? A curfew, mm. and they boarded up windows and all this. What? Yeah. And it's kind of like, like knowing, the, the knowing that like there might be a riot. So it's like if yeah. people riot or if people like yeah. protest and whatnot, it, like yeah. no one's focusing yeah. on what's actually happening with like Trump and what he's doing. I don't know. It's weird yeah. to me. It is weird. It's, it's all people. pre-planned. Mm-hmm. Like it so. has yeah. to be. Yeah. yeah. That whole country is just at its end. Like yeah. truly like they're fucked. I, yeah. I see more shit every day and I'm just like, yo. Y'all, this is yeah, for real, man. <laughs> I know. Who's running this? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, the ghetto. <laughs> like, the ghetto. Oh, for real, like, that's yeah. crazy. Yeah, no, that's fucked. And, like, Ruth Bader Ginsburg passing, like, that yeah. was honestly, like, I don't know how they're going to recover Yo. from that because they're going to put another fucking and Republican. And you know to put another one in? <laughs> Donald J. Trump. Yeah, he does. Works. He does, right before the election. Yep. Mm. Beautiful. Beautiful. I don't know. I don't know. It's a little too perfect timing for me. Yeah. It's you weird. You gonna win again. No. They fucking run no, that country. They run the world. 100% truly. Hundred percent is gonna win. I wouldn't be surprised. I think he's gonna get reelected. Yeah. 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 That, that's why they brought Kamala Harris. They can't. Oh, uh, Joe Biden brought Kamala Harris. So what? Desperation move. Yeah. Well, yo, she's trying to like. No, I don't. I don't rate her too. Like, she's doing the she's most. Like, she's, wearing, she's wearing Tim's. But low key, yeah. I feel <laughs> like, <laughs> like, 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 like she wore Tim's. Yeah, Shut no, the fuck up. Yeah, the greatest rapper alive. Like name one song. Name one. So she's asking. You should put her on the spot. Like I, I, feel really bad for Americans because they really like they have two choices of who who could run their country. Yeah. And they're both like. Yeah. It's the yeah. lesser evil. Like, yeah. the Democrats are literally the lesser evil, mm-hmm. but they're just as bad. Just as bad, yeah. yeah. No, seriously. Yeah. Seriously. The only thing I would say is get the Democrats in and put heat on them. Yeah. Put mm-hmm. heat on them. Because at least, like... If They'll you, listen, so... You can't put heat on Donald. Like, Donald does not <laughs> care. He don't give a <laughs> fuck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, he cares about TikTok. <laughs> a lot? <laughs> For real. But get the Democrats in, put heat on them, make them say what they actually claim that they're going to do. I think they're beyond repair, though, even with the Democrats. I and do. Honestly, I don't know what in the office happen. at this point. I yeah, you just need to burn it down. <laughs> me, me too. Burn me down too. Down. But that's like literally what people are <laughs> predicting. They're like, there is going to be a civil war or like a race war in America in the next couple of years. Yeah. So, and I think I keep think the borders closed. It's been time. <laughs> yeah, it's been time because yeah, no. It's yep. Just, just too much foolishness over there, and they need to sort it out. Hundred percent, and it's and, and and I'm tired of seeing it. To be honest, yeah, honestly. no problem. I'm tired. I'm sick. I'm not even like, there. Shit. And I'm sick. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm like, yeah. I'm like, I feel sorry for it. Like holy shit. I'm like, yeah. I'm also like this. Well, guys. Um, yeah. So there's a so Disney they for Chadwick Boseman for his Aww. death. Sad. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Rest in yeah. peace. Yeah. yeah, forever. Yeah, for his death. Um, Disney did a mural downtown. Downtown Disney is. I wish I could pull up the video right now. Downtown Florida. 
just a dot like I saw it's on Disney. Disney when I seen it. Yeah, like where yeah, is it? Oh, uh, maybe in the Disney Disney, Disney, Disney World, yeah, yeah, yeah. Disney World. Yeah. Yeah. or Disneyland. That was a nice world. World. Probably World. Disney really? World. Disney yeah. World. Yeah, I want to see it. Well deserved. Yeah, that one was um I. That was tragic. Yeah, I it was so wrong. tragic. I yeah. yeah. Were, okay, oh my god. I, I, there was nothing wrong with that. Like celebrities get clowned every time. But like I understand, you don't know what someone's going through. Mm-hmm. My thought was like, okay, yeah, the acting first scene. Yeah, so yeah. Because like, yeah. that happens to a lot of yeah. celebrities. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> everyone fifty did it. Yeah, like, yeah, a lot of celebs do that. So like, yeah, mm-hmm. I don't think it was wrong for people to clown them. Like people clown everybody. But like after finding out now, I'm like, oh wow, that's actually yeah, really yeah. It is very very sad. How did you guys um? How'd you guys find out? Do you remember like the moment that you kind of found oh out? God. Instagram. We were yeah. 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 Road. Yeah, we're we're, we have volleyball. Oh yeah. You were yeah. Volleyball. We're together. Like, oh, yo. Black Panther. I'm like, what's this guy talking about? Like, what? Mm-hmm. I got my phone. I go on Twitter. Like, that's the yeah. first thing I see. Just flooded. I'm like, wow. Yeah, I was um, I was like literally scrolling through Twitter and I saw like a picture of like a picture of him yeah. followed by like a picture of just like words like on a, you know like the notes app yes, so i was like oh too. maybe he's like releasing a statement about black lives matter or whatever yeah. and i like put my phone down for a couple minutes i'm like i'll come back and read it and i come back and it's like the there statement of his death and i was like what the fuck yeah. like i was shocked yeah. it was like so sad guys mm-hmm. so 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 sad a cottage actually with my friends and we were playing playing this game <laughs> it's such a good game <laughs> anyways we're playing this game and i'm just like on instagram and i see it and like everyone's just like laughing and shit mm-hmm. like, I don't say nothing. and then i just left it and we finished up the game or whatever mm. as soon as the game was done yo did you guys see <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> it's gonna cut everybody's mood and it did yeah it did. he was honestly just like so talented yeah. and such like a pillar for like the black community mm-hmm. but also mm-hmm. just like actors like up and coming actors yeah. and things like that and like he all the films that he did like the roles that he played they were big like they yeah, had a big right. impact uh, a cultural impact you know like obviously yeah. black panther and like 42, 42 yeah avengers yeah. and um yeah, yeah while he was battling his diagnosis and such like action heavy films like he has to like train right like yeah. while he was yeah. battling yeah. Muscle, I think, yeah. yeah so much weight for like black panther yeah, yeah. i like Jeez. have the utmost respect for him for doing that that's that's insane um sure. but yeah i remember like watching black panther for the first time and seeing like just like african people and black people like on twitter and stuff like what it meant to them yeah. like it was so like heartwarming yeah. to see that like yeah. what a shit accent though <laughs> <laughs> terrible <laughs> terrible yeah bad bad, bad <laughs> accent <laughs> 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 we're like what is this that's the only thing here Wow, I, I was hate when Hollywood they do like African accents. It's the worst, man. Really? Oh, man. It's the oh worst. Oh my god! <laughs> like, accent like that. Yeah. It's yeah. like I I know, forced. I, I it's forced. It's, it's too much. much. Oh, yeah? Especially um yeah. the old guy. What was his name? Oh my god! You know, Chaka? Do you remember uh, Eddie Murphy no, coming to that, America? The guy that does like the the ceremony. Oh my yeah. god! <laughs> oh no no no! The Let strength of the Black Panther. That's when I knew. I'm like, yeah. I was literally gonna ask you guys, how did you feel about seeing Black Panther for the first time? It was like it's a good movie. Yeah, but, it's but just the like, accent just killed it for you. Yeah. <laughs> I, I like the movie personally. Yeah, I like that. That was great. You didn't yeah. like it, Mike? Yeah. yeah. Because great, I don't know. Like I like a certain type of like hero movie. Mm-hmm. Like I like mm-hmm. what I want when I watch hero movies, and I just mm-hmm. I didn't like it at all. Really? Like, That's fair. I I get I get the hero feeling from it. Like it wasn't oh, like a okay. hero. It was just like a family, like a sibling, mm. like a sibling squ- like squabble. Like <laughs> there was no real villain. Like. I never mm. felt like yeah. Jordan was the villain. Like I never really. Was, yeah. Yeah, really. I, yeah, I hear you. Yeah, uh, yeah. They, they. But I feel like, I feel like they really humanized the villain. Yeah. You know, normally, like for example, like Joker, right? Like for the longest time, because I, I didn't read the comic books or nothing like that. Yeah. So for the longest time, I'm like, yo, this guy's just crazy. Yeah. And then finally, they put out the Joker movie where they kind of explain his mm. story. Whereas like Black Panther, they put all of that in one, so you don't have that hero villain. Yeah. Dichotomy. It's just like. He's, it was he's already kind of, real. Already kind of yeah. explained the villain's role. Yeah. yeah. And, and like, the relation. Got there. Yeah. Yeah. To me, it was like a yin yang kind of yeah. situation. Like yeah. light with a dark and then dark with a yeah. light. Because yeah. there was a lot of things Killmonger, things Killmonger said in that movie that I was like, I kind of like agree yeah, with yeah. you. Yeah. Like, yeah. You yeah. might be on the right track here. Yeah. So, facts, facts, yeah. Facts. Exactly. So, yeah. yeah, I get what you mean. It wasn't that, that hero of the day. Yeah. 
but I personally don't like those. So maybe that's why I love this so much. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. I've been watching those like yeah. since I was a kid, so that's what I expected. Fair enough. Like, fair enough. That's where like Black Panther you're just trying to like they knew what they were doing. They knew what they were trying yeah. to do. Yeah, but it yeah. seemed like yeah. it resonated with a lot of people because I saw like so many pictures of like people showing up in like their African like did. cultural yeah. outfits yeah. and like mm-hmm. just like kids being so excited yeah, to like yeah, they finally get a flag so we were like a big yeah yeah. yeah yeah. I always thought it was gonna be the Green Lantern. Really? Yeah. Oh yeah, he's yeah. like yeah, because yeah. I heard in the comic books he's black. Yeah, exactly. mm-hmm. and then they even on the do show, a white guy in it. Yeah. <laughs> even on Justice League. Yeah, well, yeah. yeah. No, as soon as that with like Green Lantern is that there's a bunch of them. Ones. There's a bunch yeah. of them. Oh, yeah, so black, so something just white. Oh, okay, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Like okay. The whole planet of them. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Some shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sad though. Yeah, rest yeah. in peace, Chadwick Boseman. I don't know. I wonder what they're gonna do with the movies now. Like. I know, but it kind of pissed me off that people were already talking about that. I'm like, yo, like, not enough time has passed. Time. Mm-hmm. But I saw this one tweet that was like, um, they can't do anything else except make the girl, the the sister, yeah. the new Black Panther. Like, make Shuri yeah, the new yeah, Black yeah. Panther. Yeah. I kind of like that idea. Yeah, I, liked her, I liked her in the movie. Well, she was she great. Was me fun. too, yeah. yeah. I liked her in the movie. Yeah. She was, yeah. She was, yeah. She was really yeah, good. She, she had the banter still. Yeah. yeah. The she was in um, <laughs> Top Boy. She oh, was in yeah. Top Boy, yeah. 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 She was in the first, the first one. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm Black Mirror. She, yeah, she was oh, in Black, yeah, Mirror, Black too. Mirror too. Yeah, she had that one episode where she, she got revenge. Yeah. What? Yeah, what? the, the like museum? Western one where the museum, yeah. like the museum one. Oh, oh yes, 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 yes. That's a slept on. That's a slept on. I mean, neither. I didn't like it. Her acting was good though. But shout out to all the Black UK. Actors, so they're changing, they changing it up. Like, no. yeah. yeah, like they're like yeah. they're cheaper. So like Americans are hiring them now because they're cheaper <laughs> and they have a better. But they're like, really good actors. Yeah, 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 they like, actually they're are. Really, really yeah. good. No, like they, they're, 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 they're from the UK. Yeah. Yeah. Daniel Kaluuya, yeah. Mm-hmm. he's sick. Really he's sick. Good. And John Boyega, yeah, my John babe. Boyega also. He's so sick. He's name? Nigerian, yeah, right? Nigerian. <laughs> yeah, but, 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 but. That's crazy. I, I didn't know they were they were British until like I heard them talk. I was like. Like, in yeah. the interview, I was like, what the fuck? I was, like, <laughs> I was so surprised. Yeah, I remember That's... when I found out Daniel Kaluuya was British, British. I was like, what? Like, what? like, his accent in no way. Get Out was so good. That's yeah, solid. That's crazy. <laughs> so, guys, we're almost at the end of our podcast. We're going to briefly talk about Trump Ugh. and the ban. He finally banned TikTok from, <laughs> from the States. He didn't officially ban it, but like, Yo, he can't I heard, download yeah, it I heard, again. I heard, no, no, no. Yeah. I heard it's fine. Cause they sold it. No, did they sell it? They sold it to a, an American company. When apparently. when they sold it though? Like last. They banned week. it like literally like last week because they announced that. They banned or they're they're they ho- they're to, holding it. They were going to sell it before. But yeah. And after Trump is like, all right, no news about it. I'm gonna ban. Uh, I'm banning it. Mm-hmm. So you can't download TikTok again. Same like you can still go on that. Like mm-hmm. if you're in America, you can still go on that app, right? But if but you, you delete it, you can't re-download. Yeah, you can't re-download it. Interesting. But like eventually, Americans are gonna get phased out of the app because it's gonna keep updating, right? Yeah. So, right. Yeah. So eventually, like when it's up there, like it's done for the Americans. That Jeez. sucks for all the TikTok like content I know. creators. Yeah, got, like, you know, girls got famous off TikTok and made yeah. so much money off Damn. TikTok. Life's changed because of yeah, yeah, literally so much, so much else. Like, I and now that. that Instagram, like Instagram, kind of blessed yeah. them because. Instagram like tried like homage in TikTok's idea. How does Instagram Reels. get away with that? Yeah, yo, all the time, it, bro. I mean, <laughs> so Snapchat's idea with yeah. the story, mm-hmm. like now it's so Vine. Like, yo, it's actually disgusting what Instagram's doing. But like, mm-hmm. no, no, goes to Instagram for that though. That's the thing. Like, yeah, like, I don't check out. They were doing on too much, too mm-hmm. much. Like, just stick to your posts. Okay, like, I'm like, kind of confused. Filters. What's the difference between a reel and a post? I don't know. It's, it's just like questions. Certain, like it's just literally to scale TikTok like viewers. It's no, what's shows. the what's the is real? Is it a shorter video? Is that what it is? It's like the same thing as TikTok. It it's literally like, like kind like of the same thing as TikTok. I know, okay, but I don't. I don't. Really you could go through a bunch of reels at once. Yeah, yeah you, you could just keep sliding through. Oh. Yeah, you can. You, yeah, oh. it's just reels. Yeah, but I mean that's just like their explore page. Yeah, legit. So, it's what it, so why they bite in it? They already have it. Because they want to like, to like enforce like. Okay, is it personalized now? Yeah. Like everyone has a real. Everyone yeah, can everyone make has, reels. Everyone has a real. So like some like if you go on some Instagram pages now, mm-hmm. you can see posts, reels, and. Yeah, but how do you get the real? Because do you have to download something separately? How does that work? No, you have to post it as a real. See, oh. I don't know if yeah. my phone could do that. Yeah, still. <laughs> yeah you have to post it. As a real. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know. So what? Do you normally hey. just do you just 
just go in like you're making a regular post. Yeah, exactly. And then you make it a real. Yeah. I could see it like picking up though. Because yeah, yeah. I remember when they first came out with stories, everyone was like, I'm not fucking posting on Instagram mm, stories. Yeah. Like, yeah, that was me. I was yeah, like, I was like, <laughs> I'm never going to use this. The fuck? So, so Snapchat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I still seen Snapchat, though. Like, I'll post I mean, on Snapchat. I'm not posting on Instagram. It's not as elite as Instagram now, though. Yeah. No. Nah. No. Nah. Nah. I don't think nah. so. Nah. I don't think so. I don't think it is. Yeah. No. Nah. Like, Snapchat is where I, I, I post. I don't even use Instagram, but I could just, like, I know that Snapchat. Snap, Snap is like just falling off. Like people are using it less. No, it really yeah. less. Do you see no. it falling off? I think so. I, think so. I don't Snapchat. know. I don't I know. So. I think so. Maybe maybe it's because how many people do you have on Snapchat? That's the, the mm. thing. If you have a hundred people on Snapchat, you get to see like I have a, I get a lot of content and I get a lot of content sent to me. Oh, too. I think I have yeah, so but I, I like it, I don't know. Like, I still watch people's Instagram stories, but I won't watch their Snapchat stories. I don't know if you guys do that too. Like mm. I don't really care to watch their Snapchat stories. Yeah, I only yeah. I check Instagram. I mean, I check Snapchat I check maybe snaps. like once it, every two weeks, mm-hmm. and yeah. I just look at what people have sent me. Mm-hmm. And once I look every, at Instagram wait, 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 stories. Once every two. Yeah, weeks. I'm about to say. That's still like. Whoa! I do not use Snapchat like that. Oh, I do. Yeah, I really don't. But I think that the story thing is because. The interface. No, my yeah. notifications mm. are off. Yeah, because you go to, you go on Instagram, right, and mm. it's right there. Just exactly, like you just start tap, clicking tap, tap. it. Mm. Snapchat, whereas okay, left or right, you go yeah. left. Yeah, I get true, true. to people or send some to people. Yeah. People send to me. Then Makes after sense. like all the people that you talk to, most are gonna be like yeah, yeah. yeah. Awesome. yeah so you can just watch theirs and it just goes down for you and bam, you're done. Yeah. But then like you go on Snap and like oh yeah. oh. Like, there's still some people that, like, are all the way at the totally bottom. Small. All the way I don't check. Yeah. Right? yeah. But, it, but, like, I only check, like, people that I want to check on Snapchat, mm-hmm. I would say. Like, yeah, I feel you. I never finish off Same. my stories unless I'm really, unless really I'm bored. Unless I'm bored. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah like, I'm really fucking bored. <laughs> I was, I was and, through. like, Snapchat is kind of, they did this weird thing where I see, like, regular people on the, like, media yeah. portion. I don't mm-hmm. know. I, I don't. I'm not on Snapchat like that, so I don't really know what that's about. But I found that weird. I didn't like that. Yeah, yeah. and you can like subscribe to them. Yeah, yeah, it's really like, weird. What? Yeah, that? I'm not subscribing. Yeah. To I'm not subscribing. Yeah, what do you think you are? What do you think you are? What's the purpose for that? <laughs> Snapchat has shows now too. Like yeah, shows. yeah, that's no, yeah, yeah, shows. I watch like, that. Like how long are the shows? Like, like yeah, short, but yeah, like short. ten minutes. Yeah, yeah. I watch it though. I watch, I watch them. Yeah. <laughs> They're good. There's yeah. one where it's like my my quinceanera dress. Like it's a girl like trying to find her quinceanera dress, and like they do new episodes. That's the one I watch <laughs> though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What in the hell? I watched the UFC one. Netflix. Oh, I've seen that one on Maine. It's always there. It's always there on my page. Yeah. What? Where is in the prolific prep one, do you watch the prolific um, prep? No, what's that one? It's, it's, more like, it's, it's basketball. It's not oh, no, basketball. I don't, I don't, I don't watch that one. Oh. That's crazy. Oh, wave check. Do you, I always check the wave check one. It always shows up. I, I just don't see a bunch of random people. people. <laughs> yeah, check it? It's lit still. Yeah. Some of them are lit because there's, there's people in the background. Just, ah, like, <laughs> the wave check. Yeah. Okay. Even Twitter has shows too, which is crazy. I didn't know Twitter has shows, but Twitter has shows. Twitter is live stream stuff. Bro, Twitter has shows, man. What? Yeah. It doesn't. What? Yeah, they have they, shows. They like, do like live streams of like, like cartoons and stuff. Yeah, like, I saw that, but yeah. it didn't work for me. What? It didn't work for me. I clicked on it. It didn't work for me. I clicked it. I saved it and I went on it. Oh yeah. Yeah, I went on one episode. I'm like, whoa! I'm like, nah. Like, I'll, I'll save this for later. Like, yeah. I'm not about to unravel this right now. Save it. Not what show was it? It was um. It was like an Reaper. old one. Yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, Grim? Yeah, yeah, Grim. Yeah. Grim That's what I saw. And Mandy. Yeah, Mandy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mandy and whatever. The, yeah, yeah. Yeah. The, yeah. the Adventures of Mandy and Grim. Uh, yeah, Adventures yeah. or something like that. Yeah. yeah. I love that show. Me too. That show was actually so funny. It was lit. It was lit. <laughs> it was lit. I watched it all. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, we're going to segment into our favorite set. Segment? <laughs> yeah, yeah, our favorite yeah. segment. <laughs> oh, yeah, exactly. Segment. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you for fixing that. Um, it's called Tweet Talks. Talks. And boom. What's your guys' rule on eating things that have been in the fridge? Like, how many days can it be in the fridge? Depends on the food, I think. Yeah, it depends, bro. Yeah. 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 I have a strict two-day Really? For everything? <laughs> yeah. Wait, if it's, what? What was it? Two days. Oh wow! I don't know. I taste like I just taste fridge if it's yeah. been like longer. Yeah, I just can't do it. Yeah. But I mean, after a week, I'm telling that guy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I need to buy your love first. 
a week. No, I don't like know. Two days you, for me. July first has a one day time. It does. For me, it, does. Really. it does. It does. It's crazy. <laughs> it's um, like the it's day that you eat it. The first day is the best, Great. and the second day is like yeah, it just has you. Third day you're just eating it because like <laughs> <laughs> there's nothing else to eat. So at first. Oh no! I know this video. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I love this video. Oh, man. It's a good movie though. And what you is then? Obia. Right. We evil, I'm not evil, Roman. And what you is then? I'm right from that next place. You waiting here to take us? Like you're the bus driver today? No, man, I'm on holiday. <laughs> Obia. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, it's not, he's not that bad. He's not that bad. Uh, like, you gotta uh, no. Like, that's just, was he really talking? Was, was that he? That was, <laughs> that was him. him. That was him. <laughs> that was him. Like, that's part of the movie? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No. That I wasn't sure. bad. That wasn't bad. The man said fee. I was serious. said fee. I was like, oh, shit. Really, man. I thought that was a voiceover. So if you guys, I'll explain the concept. So basically, she stole. So they're um they're punishing her by making her um dress naked in front of everyone. That's just cool. Right her, huh? Just naked? Yeah, just naked. She's naked right now. Oh, okay. Are you joking? Yeah, serious. Fam, I've seen that before. I've seen fam, that. Fam, fam. I remember the, did you Yo, see? Yeah. Did you see the one where the bad was? They made the man squat like a thousand times, fam. No, I didn't see that one. I they made a man squat a thousand times as punishment. What's going on in Nigeria? <laughs> <laughs> Remember, they used to introduce a law for um, if you rape someone. Yeah. They, <laughs> they castrate Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Cool. I agree. That one I agree with. <laughs> no, I remember, you, like, yeah, this is way, sense. way back in the day, but you remember, you told me you saw someone get, like, uh, yeah, yeah. hung before. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. when you were younger, I'm yeah. like, what the what? fuck? Yeah. Actually? Yeah. Really? yeah. But, oh, yeah, but in school. You didn't see it, though. Yeah. You just saw the aftermath. I saw the aftermath. I don't remember. Yeah, Actually, I don't that. remember. It's blurry now. Mm. But I remember in school, I saw a girl that she stole. And she got caught stealing. And she they whipped her. Oh, my made, God. And made, made her walk around with a sign, like, naked around the school. So, number three, number three. <laughs> like, walking around each class. Like, she has to, like, How go to each class. She? Like, young, like, like oh young. Like, no, nah, that's traumatizing. Yeah, what the fuck? It's it's African punishment. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah, that's for Whoa. Sure. Yeah, they instill it to you, so. <laughs> that's them for you. Masculine again. Yeah, Nigeria has a punishment, see? Yeah, I'm Lines, though. Wow. <laughs> 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 yeah, shit, all day. Wow. <laughs> so, buddy, you have to fend for yourself. She's definitely Nigerian, though. <laughs> oh, <laughs> lazy. Yeah, she listens. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't believe she bought the teaspoon out. <laughs> <She's gonna> slap <laughs> yeah, yeah. the ball up. <laughs> You gotta respect your mom. (laughs) (laughs) Respect your mom, you see. (laughs) Oh, Oh, this guy. You got accents. (laughs) You mess with it still. My sister, I'm going to tell you something. I'm not going to lie. No, 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 this guy. Uh, <laughs> it's not bad. Yeah. They should have put him in the movie still. <laughs> that one. <laughs> <laughs> that the life is like a chicken place in Nigeria.
Oh, so he lived there. Makes Aww. sense. That's why I knew what time to lie there was. Yeah. Uh, okay, next. That was cute. Yeah. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually what yeah, Nigerians so are. <laughs> Paper, bro. Oh <laughs> my god, she still has the lady part. <laughs> what? There's that's another one. The guy part. <laughs> that's, that's oh crazy. my goodness. Wow. Speaking of Nigerian movies, watch this. What? It's elite. <laughs> Yo, are these actual? <laughs> are they real? These are they actual? real? These are movies. These are movies. Yeah. The Nollywood a lot? But yeah, Nollywood, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing about these movies, they have really good plots, but they're just like... Edited like trash. Trash. <laughs> and they're just way too long. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> <laughs> This is my favorite <laughs> all time. I love that guy. <laughs> you like doing something? Why are you running? <laughs> Why are you running? Why are you running? Oh, I saw this. People know how to do it right still. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> Why are you running? Let's see. <laughs> Let's see. Jesus. Mother, this is a PSA for my mother. She has Ghanaian and Nigerian, and we can't compare both. Nigerian jollof rice is better than oh, Ghanaian. Yeah, sure. <laughs> mm-hmm. From the cook herself. <laughs> That's straight from the kitchen, man. Eh? She knows. <laughs> hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make Nigerian. <laughs> These are the ingredients that I use for my pepper you honestly? sauce. Honestly, watch this. Watch this. Two peppers, two scotch bonnets, and one red onion, Stop and it. I mix it all up. I then cut up another red onion and fried it all. Make sure it's red. And I added about half a cup of this tomato puree. I then puree. added my pepper sauce, mix it all in, and seasoned with thyme, some chicken flax seeds, and crisp. She's even using Nigerian products. After I read it. All up, I let it simmer and wash my rice in the meantime several times to remove the starch. Don't be lazy with this step. I then added the rice to the sauce. Mixed it in and added some water just to cover the rice. I let the rice cook on really low heat for about 20 minutes and then mix from the bottom up. I continued this process for 20 minutes at a time until the rice was basically done. And I also made some meat pies on the side. How did it look? It was neat. Yeah, it was neat still. I think wow. what else your verdict on it? It looked like jollof rice. Yeah. So. <laughs> I thought it was the other one. <laughs> Do you know what I'm talking about? Where it was just like mush? Yeah, I thought it was that one. And that's what's it called. I should put meat pie, which is like a lot of Nigerians love meat pie. Like Nigerians, it's a Ghanaian thing too. Like, 
Let's be cultural. We'll look on Utah, yeah? Oh, that's what call. <laughs> this is a part two of the video. <laughs> With Lisa? <laughs> Why does she look like Trump? (laughs) 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 Nah, that's actually Trump. (laughs) In a wig? (laughs) That's Trump, and that might be him. You think he's scamming her? (laughs) Of course. (laughs) Of course. Go get that visa. (laughs) (laughs) That's like Kanye. That's crazy. (laughs) He does. He does. Oh my God. Same jaw. <laughs> I, I don't even know how she goes over. Like, oh my what? gosh. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with this country. Last night, Lisa had a throw. Don't fuck up that throw. That's no good. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> like Trump. <laughs> <laughs> it's Trump and Kanye. I actually scary. can't. <laughs> Wait, he's not even kissing it. He hugged it, didn't he kiss it? (laughs) (laughs) Damn. I think he's finessing it still, low key. Damn, that's. I think he's finessing it. Oh, did you guys see this one? That one kills me. (laughs) Uzumaku. He's not that bad, he's guys. Not that bad. He it <laughs> it's smooth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He looks like me still. Yeah. It's a cool. <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 <laughs> Yo, I guess so cute. <laughs> I would know right away still, man. Good for you. No, this is fucked up. You guys see this video? I'm off this. <laughs> oh my god. What are you guys doing in that situation? I'm, I'm, I'm Zigzag, bro. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm hopping over the fence. I'm tripping you still. <laughs> Bad mind. <laughs> right. Oh gosh. So um Cabana, do you want to explain what's happening in this video? It's an evil dog, that's all I have to say. It. Oh. Ah. <laughs> 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 the that day. It's an evil dog. Wait, wait, yo, replay that. <laughs> it's dumb, it's at the bottom. Oh, okay. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> why the dog snap? <laughs> that dog is like, no idea. it bites that everyone. Was demonic, it was demonic, bro. That dog was actually demonic. Like, it came from man for no reason sometimes. Mm. Like, I'm not even going to lie to you. Oh, was that? That was him. That was, that was, that was you, Cabana? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh, that was you? That was me, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This is the scariest dog I've ever met in my life. You know what? We should just call it a wrap. So. Actually, Let's really eat the though. rice. Yeah, I'm mm. is hungry. It's okay. Two talks is good. Today. I'm proper hungry. Mm. I actually enjoyed that. That was funny. Let's get it. Oh, come on, you're going to lose some sort of dog. All right. Well, yeah. Best rice win, man. <laughs> <laughs> the best okay. rice win. <laughs> Which one are we trying first, guys? What are you doing first? <laughs> first, look okay. at um, Low key. Come in, come in. My dream. Come in. My dream. Come in.
Can we um, start off uh, by talking a little bit about the contents of Jollof Rice? So can you guys talk to us a little bit about um, what's in it? How is it made? So basically, <clears throat> it's like a it's a rice commonly eaten around like West Africa. Mm -hmm. So it's not like only specific to like one country. Like everyone has their own version of it. But everyone, it's essentially just like tomato sauce and then you add rice into it some little spices and whatnot and let the rice cook in inside the tomato sauce absorb everything and you got jollof rice nice and how do you typically eat it like do you eat it with like another dish yeah with uh like a protein so like some chicken like mine i'd go in it mm -hmm. fish boiled eggs Ghanians love boiled eggs boiled eggs nice they love it all I don't right. like eggs, so. though. <laughs> and I hate them boiled. It's Me too. So I, I, mm -hmm. I, I, I love boiled eggs. So. You love boiled Stink. eggs? Why? Stink up the house. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why you like boiled eggs? Uh, Is healthier? it the taste? Yeah. It's, not, it's the same thing. What do you mean it's healthier? Because I'm not eating fried. Okay. Oh, okay. Because okay. boiling? That's yeah. true. That's true. I guess, yeah. Yeah. What about well, some people mix it? in the jello anyway. fried, too. Yeah, yeah. I see that. Your bacon I see that. But don't you find like the two different textures um strange or that's okay with you? No, I enjoy it. Oh, okay. I enjoy it. Like your white rice, I don't think you eat it with white rice. I feel like that would be Egg disgusting. With white rice? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, no. Yeah. No, that is no. Be disgusting. My dad made me you eat boiled eggs with anything. That's <laughs> 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 <It was> weird. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I like I like fried eggs and scrambled eggs, but whatever. No, That's whatever anyway. in the morning. Yeah. I'm not really trying to eat it. Nah, nah, nah. No? <laughs> I feel that. Nice I feel that. But but there's not usually eggs in jollof, is there? No, no, no. No, no. But not like it's a combination though. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It'll be the protein. My bad. Yeah. My bad. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of like fried rice. Like fried rice sometimes yeah. has egg. Mm. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, who wants to start us off? Give us a little review of um, the two types of jollof that we ate today. Tasha? Okay. Nigerian. You want to talk to Nigerian jollof rice first? Yeah, sure. Uh, Nigerian jollof rice, it was good. It was actually, yeah, it was really good. It was, uh, I shouldn't say actually. I wasn't, I wasn't surprised. I was just listening to it. But, um, yeah, it, it was really tomatoey and spicy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then the Ghanaian rice. And it was a lot of flavors. Um, the goat was a nice touch. Mm -hmm. It wasn't yeah. as tomato -y, though. I didn't really taste any tomato. It's not wet. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Maybe that's what it was. Yeah. Do you want me to say who won? Um, we'll we'll save, we'll save it. Till, we'll, we'll save it till the it. end. Yeah. 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 Okay. After yeah. everyone's given their yeah. review. I can't really explain the game yet. Yeah. Good. Yeah. It was good. It was my first time trying jollof, and they were both delicious. Really, really, really good. Mm -hmm. um, same as Tasha said, the Nigerian one was more, like, I definitely tasted the tomato more, and I liked the spice. It was really good. And that one was jasmine, I think, rice, made with jasmine rice. So it was just, like, a bit thicker, and I liked that. Um, and then the Ghanaian one, it was really good. I liked the, like sort of um taste of the lamb and the rice it was really good and the spices and that one was basmati so it tasted more like what we like i make at home like what my family makes at home gave me like biryani vibes so it was so yeah i might be a little biased but it was really good <laughs> how about you clubs to be fair uh, i've only had uh, nigerian jollof rice once and it wasn't the best experience but this one's actually pretty good i can't lie mm -hmm. but like i could tell the difference between both of them like from what i heard i always hear like nigerian jollof rice it's like more stewy mm -hmm. and like tomatoey yeah like, i guess that's in it and like ours is more like cooked down i yeah. maybe a little bit more flavors with like the sauce. the go and everything in it mm -hmm. but it wasn't bad but you know which one's better but i'm sorry <laughs> <laughs> my bad I'm <laughs> glad you enjoy uh, it was, it was whatever. 
After all no, the drama. It wasn't whatever. It was good. I, I feel it was good. It was enjoyable. But I don't think that would satisfy me. It wouldn't like, see you cop. like... It wouldn't see you like... <laughs> huh? It wouldn't satisfy my needs. Like, my needs. Not, the device isn't thick enough. Like, mm. uh, I'm not looking for flavors. I'm looking for something like... Mm-hmm. It's gonna slump me like jollof rice is gonna slump me. Yeah. Like Nigerian jollof is gonna slump me. I feel like that's an appetizer. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. Jordan? Um, I thought they both tasted tasted great. Like they're both flavorful. I thought. Um, the more the Nigerian one was more spicy to me, mm-hmm. and it had more of like a, like a tomato flavor. It was more, it just like more. <sighs> it was fresher. In my, in my, it, it tasted more fresh. Mm. If that makes sense, like when I had the, the Ghanaian one, it was more salty and like, sp- like spicy. I guess not, not, not necessarily like hot and spice, but more just flavorful. Yeah, like I more, I tasted more different things. Yeah, 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 exactly. And that probably has to do with like the goat being cooked with it. It probably like seeped out its flavors into it, and it was really good because I love goat. Is it goat? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, oh. it must have been. It must. It tastes oh. really good. In the water? I think she put it in the like, the, the tomato sauce. Yeah. Like I she cooks it separately but then puts it adds gotcha. everything into the tomato sauce. Gotcha, gotcha. So then when like everything emulsifies yeah. together. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Alright. Yeah. Um I can share this. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Hundred percent. I'll share it. Yeah. It's a big Tupperware of it. And usually you're saying like Whenever it's made, it's usually a lot, yeah, right? Like Do a batch. Yeah. Usually, it's usually a batch, right? Do a batch, yeah. yeah have you the first day, and then, like, a couple of days after. Yeah. So definitely. Uh-huh. I'll share it with you. Will it slump you? Is it filling? Yeah. Definitely. definitely. Mm-hmm. definitely. Yeah. If you have a big enough bowl, yeah, this yeah. will deal with you yeah. still. <laughs> yeah. But, like, keep in mind, you're eating, like, the, the protein with it, too, right? Yeah, like, you're eating exactly. the chicken yeah. and stuff yeah, exactly. with it, too, so... Yeah. And the Nigerian one didn't have the the protein in it. Yeah. So mind you, you'd usually have like a protein on the side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that rice and was that, that was heavy rice. It was. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It was heavier. Right. Definitely. definitely. Mm-hmm. Let's give our final verdicts. Then yeah. we'll start with um, the most obvious one, Michael. Um, <laughs> I just want to say some a few pointers yeah. before, <laughs> before we vote. <laughs> First off, um, Kobana rice was made today. Fresh. Excuse me. <laughs> Mine was made about a week ago. Anything, so anything about way, jollof rice is a, a week. No, I don't like know. Two you, days jollof rice has a one day time it does, for me. It does. Really. It does. It does. It's crazy. Uh, <laughs> excuse me. I gave us it's probably today. Bro. Seven, seven no, no, no. no. Literally seven days ago. Um, It's a week old. Excuse he me. didn't tell us that before we ate it. Yeah. <laughs> After we all uh, put it in our mouth. You want to go upstairs? Excuse me. Yeah, don't say. Nah, but yeah. No. yeah. And Corbana's mom is a cook, man. It and doesn't matter, bro. It doesn't matter. Your mom cooked. My mom probably made jollof rice before she ever even thought she would work in the kitchen. Fuck the window. My mom doesn't touch the kitchen. Like... What? She make pancakes. You're airing your mom out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 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 we'll have to stop you right there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, my there. grandma's a cook, yeah. She doesn't cook anymore, so you're lucky. It's all just sad excuses, bro. The pen of the pen. Give yeah, us your verdict, there. Mikey. Yeah, Come yeah, on. No, no, Nigerian. Nigerian on the job. Oh, okay. Nigerian? Okay, all right. So that's so what... Nigeria? Yeah, for sure. Okay. All right, okay. one point for Nigeria. Is that, okay, <laughs> is that, like, is that loyalty or is that is that your heart? Um, it's just cause um, no, nah, like the Ghanaian one did taste of, like it tasted well, but it wouldn't like it I, I don't want. It, yeah. it wasn't close to home, yeah. Yeah. Like I don't want like mm-hmm. if I like I can't eat a full batch of that. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. like they just feel tedious. Like well, it's like tedious. <laughs> yeah. I'm done. Yeah, that's whereas, like, too much work. <laughs> you're trying to eat a lot. Yeah, like, I hear you. It's it's gonna deal with me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, fair enough. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. Okay. And, and there was no protein in our. In the Nigerian one, Excuse. there's protein in the Ghanaian one. You should have come yes. ready. Oh, you should have came with the protein. I was cheating. <laughs> Bro, you told me to bring jollof rice. Right. I bought jollof rice. Yeah, yeah but jollof rice and go. It's how I've always eaten jollof rice. And go. I know no better, bro. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Is it jollof rice or is this is jollof rice with jollof rice and go? That's how this is. 
Yo, should, yo, should I go get chicken for you guys? Like, season, season <laughs> Nigerian chicken? I'll go get her, eh? Season Nigerian chicken. Like, change, your, change your mind. Oh All right, Tasha, give us uh, your verdict. <laughs> I am going to have to go with the Ganyan. Ooh. But, but that's because, one, um, I love Basmati rice. Like, love. And that's what you said. I think so. I have no idea. Yeah, I think it's Basmati. I like the smaller grain rice. Um, and the goat. Uh, I don't even like goat, and I like that. Um, okay, so you. And, <laughs> and on top of that, I'm not like I d- don't get me wrong. I loved the Nigerian one. The Nigerian one was good, and I don't like tomato too much, too tough either. So that's also why. Okay, so tomato, basmati, and goat, which is Hallelujah. <laughs> okay. So, so far, one point for Nigeria, one point, point for, for Ghana. For basmati and goat. One point for the goat. <laughs> yeah, where are you? No, we're going to go what? What? Pops next. Give us your verdict. My verdict, obviously. <laughs> I'm not saying it because again, I just in, I like the Ganyan. Like if I was, I don't know, from Peru, <laughs> I'd probably choose Ganyan jollof. It's just more flavor to it. I don't know. Like Nigerian jollof is just it's stew. It's stew rice. Like it's not much to it. There's more flavors. There's, there's more adventure. You know. More adventure. <laughs> more adventure. I don't know. I've seen like, more character. I've more seen more character for, to it. Stories at African like or Nigerian stores, mm. like. People our age, mm-hmm. and they and they go to go buy, it and it's obviously more advanced because it's just cooked, and they it's probably more flavorful than excuses, my mom makes bro. it. Just saying, <laughs> just saying, right, that right. depends on the cook. But mm-hmm. I don't know. Okay, so point number two for Ghana. Bro, you're telling it <laughs> wrong. That's their first point. The first point was, was for gold. <laughs> 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 Okay, um, my verdict, I want to preface it by saying I actually really enjoyed both of them, and they're both something I would eat. Yeah. Like, yeah. if I had it my way, it w- I would eat both of them. Um, however, I think the Ghanaian ri- uh, jollof just, like, hit closer to home. Because of the basmati, right? Because of the bas- okay. Yeah, because of the basmati. And <laughs> 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 no, not just that. To though, be fair, I, I don't think it's basmati rice. You don't think so? I, I think, think it's, it is. I think it's just regular white rice, to be no. honest. That's definitely no, not regular. No, no, no. It's not. No, because he used regular white rice. Yeah. I don't, I, I, the I don't, only thing I don't is, know if we have his basmati at home. To be basmati honest. is usually like longer. Yeah. Right. Mm-hmm. This one wasn't as it's it wasn't as grain. long, yeah. so maybe it wasn't that. Was. Either way, like that. yeah. Either way. I'm still going with that one because. Is this Nigeria versus Dolph or Nigeria versus everything? <laughs> like, to be fair, Nigeria's up against Ghost, but that might, might be brown rice, no cap. <laughs> yeah. This one? It might be brown rice. That might that's yeah, most yeah, likely right. jasmine or white rice. Okay. Okay. But but the spices too, like the yeah, and the, yeah the the flavor um. Yeah, I just, I really liked it. But I also really like the Nigerian, and I think your mom is a good cook, so yeah. stop. Uh, yeah, it was <laughs> yeah, good. Yeah, look how friendly you are. Look the hell. <laughs> she did a great job, and they're both, like, homemade, so, like, homemade food is always just so good. Like, it's, it always just tastes good, regardless good. of who the cook is. Yeah, great. so. So, yeah, point number three for Ghana. <laughs> Nigeria's <laughs> one. It's 1-1. Moving on God. to Joran. Give us yeah. your final verdict. Yeah, um, they both taste great. Um, like I said before, the Ghana, the Ghana one had way more, not way more, but it had more, more levels to the flavor, <laughs> if that makes sense, mm-hmm. the, you know? It's been through things. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Mom is a cook in my name. Exactly. If that, if that, oh if my god, it, relax. If that's, if, that's it, if that's what it is, okay. Today I'm gonna have to give my my point to 
Ghanaian. You know what I should have done? <laughs> you know what I should have done? We should have gone. I should have ordered from a professional place. Oh my God, Mike! Combined with his. Mike, God. Am I lying? Mom, I'm in the <laughs> it is not your mom's job. fault at all. We could do that too. I know again. You, my this is round one. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Round, round one. one. Round one. Round one. Homegrown, Most and uh, next one is gonna be like catered. Yeah. yeah. Catered. Thank catered. you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be a wrap. I'll never disrespect the homeland. Take it in. My dad, my dad doesn't even eat our own jollof rice. He orders it. Look at all these excuses. Look how tough like, he was talking he really before. Does. He's I trying so hard. It's diverging, bro. Just audience. diverging, bro. So today's episode, Ghana versus Nigeria. Ghana takes this one no, still. No, it doesn't. It takes a slight edge. Go. <laughs> Go. Takes it. Go. And I can't lie, after all the shit that Michael has been talking, like, it's just an ironic ending, isn't it, For Mike? years. <laughs> they just want to see me lose. Like, oh. And this is not it's even not a good right. batch, I told you. Like, I don't know, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah, mine, that it looks great, good, so. Yeah, mine, yeah, mine's a week old. <laughs> mine's a week old. A week. A week. You sit in the fridge for a week. I'll call my mom and I'll tell her exactly. When I went downstairs to go pick her up, she's like, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's what she said. Yeah, because she it like mushed up. Like this is mushy. Like you know what I mean. A week I old. Good. She just a cooked week. too much. That it. A week old. No, we running this back. I don't care. We will. I'm not having it. I think that's a fair. Uh, let me let's close it off by asking: Is jollof better than rice and peas? Nah, nah. I'm getting it. I say no, bro. Tomatoes. I say no. But you know what's funny? Like we have rice and peas too. Like, yeah. it's we, oddly peas enough, like, it's the same, the exact same, same, same thing. Ours is just, it's more like, um, like, it's, the rice is more cooked. We call it watch it, mm. but it's like more cooked. I can't explain yeah. it. Nigerians have that too, Mike? Like, uh, steam? no. <laughs> it's steamed, <laughs> like, but no, like, we don't claim that. <laughs> no, no, no. We eat rice and beans. The, oh, okay. I don't know, the water from the beans. The water you know when you, is less, yeah. There's less water content. Though. Yeah, it's like really, really like mushy and like, oh. yeah. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, even Jamaican food, you would be very surprised. It's very similar. similar. Yeah. Very but similar. Say, like, Jamaican rice and beans. That's, same people. Though, same people. No, really? Yeah, yeah. 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 are like everybody because they try to be like everybody. They try to be like Jamaican. Oh, what is oh, this? Land- yeah. What? <laughs> but no, no. That's another topic what? for another day. Though. <laughs> yeah, let that one go. Yeah, what? Yeah. <laughs> He's wild. <violent, right? laughs> <laughs> <That's right. laughs> We're not to hurt. cut it here. <laughs> it's off the jello. That's all. All right. So it's been a great podcast. I appreciate our guest, Kobena. Thank you for having me. I appreciate the 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 jello. Thank you so much. Really no good. worries. Any days. It was great. Any day. Tasha. We deliver. You know. I love, <laughs> <laughs> I love the content. Also, Black Execs, we will post and plug everything. Yeah. And, and obviously, <laughs> we'll see more in the future, I'm sure. Yeah. I'm sure, I'm sure. <laughs> um, and on that note, if there's anything you guys want to plug before, aside from what I said, <laughs> um, you guys could go. Tasha, if you want to plug any last little bits before you get out of here. Know. I feel like I'm can you, can you tell us where to get your t shirt? Oh, actually, this is not this. It's at least exclusive. Yeah, I would, I would, I would get one. Yeah. Yo, don't play with me. Next giveaway, Tasha. Next giveaway. Yeah, because I'm thinking about getting hoodies because my skin's cold out. That's a great idea. That's what I picture in my head. I'm like, yo, that's the first and all hoodie. Black exact hoodie. Follow us on at Black Effect Podcast. Mm-hmm. Oh no, wrong. Sorry, that's our website. Mm-hmm. So check <laughs> <laughs> us out on blackeffect.com. You can follow us on Instagram oh, yeah. at Black Effect Podcast. See, see, Cabana, anything to plug? Um, I don't know. There's no rules in life. Just be kind to everyone. Oh, mm-hmm. <laughs> that was a lovely ending. Okay, love it, man. Hey. <laughs>